We are back for part two of the Collider Collision. I'm Chris Doman for Take 3 Productions. With me, I've got Jacob and his girlfriend, Lauren. Again, Lauren, thank you for being on for part two of this video. Evan DeGraff, the king of controversy this week around the office. And apparently the guy who was so cool, he got name dropped on the rundown like 20 freaking times. Matthew Kearns. <laughs> so, Matt, uh... For the triple threat, you've got uh, Roca, right? <laughs> <sighs> I would like to officially announce my resignation from Take 3. For that. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a hell of a time, is what I wish I could say. Yeah, okay. with firing one and someone's resigning. <laughs> Jesus, what a week. <laughs> <laughs> Well, yeah, that's why we brought on Kristen. <laughs> okay, all right, <laughs> okay. Hey, Lauren's here. Yeah, was, yeah, all right. That's true, that's true. We do have Lauren now here as a, as a special guest. But, okay, in all seriousness, this is this is unprecedented. A three-way title match. We've never seen this before. Can we, so should I, should I just stop talking and let's just get to it? Yeah, can we just get We've to it? We've never seen so that before, before but I'm more excited it. for Harlow Bruce Snyder. Yeah, true, <laughs> really? same. But still, let's just get to it. All right, guys. Okay, all right. <laughs> we click play in three, two, one, play. Oh, God. Five seconds. <laughs> yeah, it's not that long. Nope. That was pretty painless. Yeah, don't go. No, nah, that hurt five seconds of my life. I'm dead now. Oh. We got this more of this. Okay. Nice. <laughs> oh. That's a bit awkward. Yep. Just a little bit. <laughs> and your winner, Christian Harbaugh! I love the shock in his face. Like, what the? <laughs> I was, I was thinking about maybe stepping back if, if things didn't go my way today, but right now it's five and three. I'm kind of up there. So it's maybe time for me to shut someone's mouth who keeps challenging me. And I'm kind of, it's like, okay, we get it. You're a new guy and you want to get your job, but Bibiani, I'm calling you out. Oh, there you are. Come on in. You're calling me out. Sorry, Emma. <laughs> Sorry, stay here. Stay here. Weeks. I've been waiting outside that door, just waiting I for you to you respond have. to this challenge. So you're ready to do this? I am ready to me do this. Me and you. I am ready. I am all right. ready to kick uh, some uh, R off all over place. <laughs> okay. It's going to be here. I'll give you something else. If you can beat me, then I will give you the winner of McQueenie and Snyder and to play that person at the Collider Collision. If you're going to show that you're strong at movie trivia, you should take down the guy who asks all the movie trivia. He thinks it's so easy. Well, it's real easy when you look at the answers all day. I actually have to know this stuff off the top oh. of my head. <laughs> it's me now that's going to be playing Jeff Snyder, which is weird. I didn't want this. I just wanted to call the match, but you decided to just spout off your bullshit. And your winner! <laughs> that face says it all. That was just like... That was a piece of, I guess I'm not retiring now. <laughs> oh. I still reckon the reason why he thought Bibiani was like, well, Bibiani's definitely beating me. Everyone exactly. else actually beat That's why. You've been calling me out for a very long time. Uh, also because... I me all the time how much you forget, title match, and it's pretty Harloff would have loved that this was McQueenie, Bibiani, or Bibiani Snyder right now. Relish take down. It's Harloff. I already showed what I can do here in the doubles. I, I've conquered this. I've, we've won four title matches. Now I'm focused on singles, okay? I'm going to be playing Christian I still Harlow think Harlow's going to win, but Snyder right, coming exactly. off I'm of coming that win on Tuesday belt. is something go him to, to not it. be, Consider it done. you know, taken lightly. Oh, the theme in the back is so good. Go, oh, Harlow. Come on. Come on, Harlow. Come on. Other Please. Than Chris Stockman, has Snyder lost a match? Sam Levine. Yeah, oh, Sam Levine right. and Chris Stockman. Both were close. Unreal. I know Levine was one point. 
And we are back. Ken, what else can you ask for? Two matches down, both matches coming down to the final question. This is the type of stuff you come to expect from these main events. Absolutely. That final question in my game is still gnawing at me like the <laughs> spicy sausage you just had during a quick break. John, it's good to have you back at the table. Let's, it's good uh, to be back. We've got a big match here today. We have got the commissioner, the commish, Christian Harloff, and the insider, Jeff Snyder. Um, this is a number one contenders match. Yeah. The winner of this gets a title shot in August. But, John, both these men really weren't supposed to be here by all accounts. No, well, we were, we've seen two giants in this league enter, both in the Beast Bibiani and Drew McQueenie. These two guys beat those guys to get into this position. Now, Christian Harloff wanted to call this match. We thought that might have been a little bit of a conflict a of interest. <laughs> so he's going to sit back. The two of us are going to take this one today. Absolutely. Uh, Harloff, he beat Signore, beat Bibiani, Snyder over Makuga, McWeeny. That is what brings us here today again. This is a number one contenders match. Normal three rounds apply here, but there is a lot riding on this one, John. John, I think we should hear from the competitors. They had a lot to say before the match. I, oh, thought, I thought he was about to say Booker T. I was like, finally, no way. The commission They're has saving come Booker back. T for the triple threat. Home. What you're looking at here is the first double champion. It's going to happen. I actually, I re I actually reckon it will. Christian I do bubble. think it's going to happen. I'm going to address the first thing first. Yeah, I can't believe that you made all those questions go in your favor so then you can play in the collision. Why would I do that? <laughs> I have to run this thing, hence the commissioner. <laughs> I didn't want to play Bibiani, but I also don't come to lose. I play, and I'll continue to play. You know what I was thinking about this guy? He gets the easiest questions. It's like, what mustard does he put on his hot dogs when he's grilling outside in the parking lot? <laughs> uh, so easy to answer. I Same kind of question really we asked. He literally has Chris mm -hmm. Galicki. Yeah, on I'm going for Harloff, yeah, but exactly I think right. Schneider yeah. will win. It's a conspiracy okay. theory. There always will Harloff be. Harloff will and should win. I told him the commissioner, then there'll be none. Tom I know what the team wins. championship did to that man. It made him think that he's a lot more important <laughs> than he really is. And now he thinks he's got to go through me to get to the big title shot, to get to the, who, if it's Riley, if it's Roca, if it's Merle. That's what he wants to do. I'm not looking past Christian Harloff in this match, but I'm hungry. I'm coming for that singles belt, and I want it bad. Doesn't matter who I got to be to get it. It's it's gonna be mine. It's gonna be around this waist right here. You know you're the best in this game. I think I'm pretty good at this game. I think I can do what I need to do. Like I said, do I want to be playing for the championship? Do I want the title? I'll tell you right now, no. I don't want to be here right now. I want to be running this thing. I want to be asking someone else the questions. But I don't have it in me to A, fix anything. I don't have it in me to drop anything except Jeff Snyder. I'll drop oh. Jeff Snyder. Christian Harloff, brother, let me tell you, you're in for a world of pain today, and I don't see a Would doctor you call in the house. A person throwing a match, Bottom fixing line, the match. Finish. Yep. You're a loser. Yep. Jackpot. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you right now that I'm re representing you guys. I'm re representing all of the Schmodown to let you guys know what real competitive. I thought that was late to the party. About. It's going to happen today. <laughs> I'm bringing my A game, and I'm going to take him down, the Insider, and it's time this, for the Lions to, this is to get be good. dropped down and to have Dagnino and that stupid Let's go, Christian. face Come on. and that smile to <laughs> just stop with his, oh, yeah, I mean, what, what do you expect? I mean, come on, what do, what do you think? I'm going to expect you to go back to that trash can that you're from. <laughs> the Lions den Thank you, Oscar. Oh. Where in the world is Booker T? Is that from this phone? Oh my god, he's, actually, he's not on his phone. Champ, WWE Hall of Famer. Hates collision. And yes, we are here on the Smodown. This week, guys, this match is going to be like Steamboat Savage. WrestleMania 3, one of the greatest matches, if not the greatest match of all time. This week on the Smodown, number one contenders match. The commissioner, Christian Harloff, taking on Jeff Schneider. Now we all know, man, <laughs> Christian Harloff, the man has been said. on a roll lately. He's burning it up with three in a row, man. The dude. He knows this trivia, dog. But let me tell you something. Schneider, he's deadly. As well as he is 
the team champion. His confidence is through the roof right now. But if I had to pick someone, if I had to put money on them out of my pocket, I'm going with the commissioner, dog. The commissioner. I kind of thought they were going to go with Carlos. I still he, really want to know if someone has like, like they just had percentage off. of how many times Booker T has predicted correctly. I think Frank did it. It said something Jeff like it's Snyder 70%. Is, is just a machine. I've seen this guy compete now. I'm constantly impressed. It's almost scary, but he has a lot of strings like Oscars, classics, flashing the attitude of a 1980s villain. It is what he does well. Christian Harloff, of course, we know Star Wars. Five knockouts from Harloff. Movies. Like, I don't know if people, like, actually, like, things. A lot of people recognize that. that Christian. I mean, and, of course, one of his strengths people is should. creating or this better. playground for all of us to dance in. Oh, but you're going to get a, yeah, right, two of those for thin stuff. Cody. Let's get ready Shut to schmoe down. Yeah, that's not bad, Campion. It's not bad. Three rounds okay, it's not gonna for do the it. number one contendership. Yeah, there's something first. happening at the end of this video because there's no way that that match goes for two hours. Ryan yeah, that's my point. That's what I said earlier. The All the booze. I got a boom too, but this music is so good. Well, the, the triple, the triple match will move over two hours. That's the line, the I forgot about him, Jacob. Snyder! Coming out, of course, with his laundry. Oh! <laughs> and here he comes. Could he be the wow. first guy to hold a tag team title and a heavyweight title? Could be that kind of double threat right here. Right, the line center, like, I gotta be honest, Earth, it's such a yeah, better. That's right. take, take that damn toothpick out of your mouth there, Snyder. Sorry, what? they are, they are a much the better plan to wish uh, than, good luck than the Four Horsemen. I'm sorry to say that, but the Four Horsemen are just, they come together and they're always there, and I enjoy them about yeah. the, like, the line center. He's I hate opponent. them, but they're there, and it's, they're exciting to watch. What this entrance gonna be? This. Representing Schmoes, No, and Kaleida with a record of six wins, three defeats, and five knockouts. What the hell is going on? 2015 Ultimate Schmodown winner and the former movie trivia Schmodown champion of the world. And I don't even know who that is. Right I don't know who that is either. That's know. someone that they know. The commissioner. She looks well, really familiar. I just hope it's someone they know. No chance. You know, oh, no chance, has baby. A lot of big defeats in this league, yeah. high, high profile, but he's also enjoyed a lot of big victories, especially over the last and couple of months. Is he putting pressure on himself? John and people kind of keep doing that because he's so busy behind the scenes. But he started oh. this. Is he putting pressure on himself? Mark Ellis for a reason. They Ooh, know nah. stuff. Right, no, guys, he, that's probably in, he wants to lose, and so he wants to have a good last both entrance. Have great sunglasses on. That's what this I would is think. like some sort of commercial for Sunglass Hut. <laughs> no. I'll explain the rules of round one. See Ray Competitors to the will commissioner. receive oh, eight <laughs> of the same questions. Competitors will write down their answers. Competitors oh, must yeah. speak and reveal the answer they have written down. No, Snyder spelling does not necessarily what? count. Doing Each right. correct answer hey, is you just worth have to beat one Evan. point. It's not that Gentlemen. difficult. Or yeah, she hasn't done it. Not difficult so, at all. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have a white and, and just putting an arrow to me and saying Jacob's Jeff, answer doesn't count. When you're 10 to 2 all the time, you're always ready. <laughs> Who's ready to go? Then take us in, John. All right. <laughs> you're two losses have been single. Love you. Sorry. As in the other matches, we have two specific rules here. We have the JTE rule. The competitors will at any time be allowed to ask for a repeating of the question no more than three times during the match. There is also the ability to challenge. If they question the judgment of the judges at Hasn't any been point used at this the match, they can issue a challenge. A this third judge match we're to really to use. If the initial wasn't ruling needed, is really, in many of the other ones. The competitor will still have that challenge to use Not yet. the match. However, if the rule is Wait, who do you think the third judge is? That challenge. With what, all that out of the what way, do you mean? gentlemen, let's move on to your know. first um, question great in question. round Kelly, number me, Perry. one. Your Here we first go. question comes from oh, the yeah. category of action adventure. All right. What 2005 film starred Scarlett Johansson <laughs> opposite <gasps> Ewan McGregor? There's a movie with the two of them. 
attention. This is. Hey, got one. <laughs> I don't like when we do this because I don't have a whiteboard prepared, so and I can't shout out the answers. One. I have no Christian clue. Harlock. If it's chance, buddy, I like. Correct. Let go one. Harlock. There you go. <laughs> wait, wait. Sorry, did Evan not get that? <laughs> I'm right. beating Evan. Yeah. <laughs> used to that already, huh? Question you want a cookie? Two category famous directors. Famous directors. Which Stanley Kubrick film features a monolith? Um, a monolith. Oh, important. Evan, you don't know this? You know. Questions. We'll let that one go. God, I get enough. Five, four, nah. three, two, one. Pens down. She doesn't want a space odyssey. odyssey. Uh, that is correct. Uh, Christian Harloff. How did I not know that? All right. Oh, did not. I know something the champ right. doesn't know. Okay. Jeff oh. streaks into the lead. Plot it at your ass. <laughs> All right, guys. Your third question shot, comes man. to you in the form of fantasy sci-fi. What is the name of E.T.'s ten-year-old friend in E.T.? You know, John, I didn't have a lot of friends when I was 10. <laughs> <laughs> you serious, Evan? You... All right, five, four, I haven't seen it. three, I haven't seen two, it in four one. years. Christian it's not Carl that one, Elliot. 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 Uh, I want it. Gertie. Oh! 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 Yeah! yeah! I thought yes, I was going to have someone Snyder. right now. swings back. I thought yeah, someone would do that. Again. Back. All right, all right. I had Barry Lemon. We know there's not going to be a perfect first round, John. All right. <laughs> the crowd, the crowd is, Jesus. You know, what, question number four in the category is dramas. Gentlemen, question in. What 90s film is about a scheme to cover up a presidential scandal by producing a fake war? Truly it, has anyone seen this? Absolutely it's is. It's so and funny. Robert De Niro and Dustin Hoffman. Five. I can't think oh, Such oh, a great movie. Repeat the question. He's going to be using one of his yeah. repeat the questions. Yeah. What 90s film is about a scheme to cover up a presidential scandal by producing a fake war? Five. There's two of those left. Four. No, He's got it. Yeah, yeah two, he got it. One. And Jeff Wag Snyder. Wag the dog. Yeah, Wag the dog. That is correct. <laughs> Christian Harloff. Wag the dog. Right. Correct. Good job. That stall tactic what? may have worked for yep. Harloff there. Thank God. We'll I think Harloff Harlo first. Sorry? What, yeah. Uh, All right, guys. Six or eight. Your fifth remember. question in the category of comedies. In what comedy would you hear oh, the line, be a comedian. "Husband, wait a minute. What was all that one in a million talk?" <sighs> Half the crowd Here. growing. Half the ha uh, crowd happy with that, John. Why? Why does Five, this sound so familiar? Four, three. How dumb am I? Two, is it Honey, I Shrunk the Kids? One. Christian Harloff. Spaceballs? There's something about Mary. Incorrect. <sighs> Jeff. I also put There's Something About Mary. <laughs> we were looking for our two competitors, Dumb and Dumber. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> How many yeah, guys that's good. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Cops, oh, someone so check Copster's blood pressure. Yeah. <laughs> question, Back to the future question. you going to kill us. Question oh. six category is animated. Animated films. What is the name of the whale oh, maybe in I Disney's know Pinocchio? This would be a tricky one for a lot of people. It yep. Knows the whale. Boom, baby. Done. Uh, that's why we play it here. Yeah, that one instantly. That's why we play. Come on. No, Five. Come on. Four, three, Come on. Oh, shit. He's overwriting. Two, nope. One. And Jeff Schneider. Monstro. Put blubber. <laughs> Sorry. I put Jumbo the Big Fuck. <laughs> nope. We were looking for I'm Monstro. Really that was the name of Dumbo's mother. Monstro Jumbo. The whale. Man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. It's a scary movie. Your Look you, it's a scary question. movie, okay? In I will fight anybody on that. Comes to you in the category of Oscar films. Jack Nicholson, Helen Hunt, and Greg Kinnear oh. all received Oscar nominations for what 1990s film? Twister, of course. Do you remember the 90s? Is it? Very, very is it what I think it is? Time, to be honest with you. you nope, nope, it's not. Cover that, right? not. <laughs> <laughs> right, going five, based off of Jack four, Nicholson. Three, We're dicks. Two, one, and Christian Harlock. Shut up! So not as good as it gets. No, what? as good as oh, it gets. Oh, shit! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Challenge. Oh. Look at his board. Look at his board. It, gets. it looks like a fucking bee. 
Good as it bets. Good as it bets. Oh. Oh, no, 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 one second. No, 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 no wait, 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 wait. wait. I quoted, I quoted the movie. Jeff Snyder. Are you actually using this as your challenge? No. Okay. okay. He's okay. not challenging. Two Ooh. points what around a, the board for everybody. What a, what a filthy rat. rat. That's a Snyder Tom. move. Tom. That's a Snyder move. Are you all right. challenging? No, he's not. All right. All right. They're not, they're not in here. Someone keep I can't be bothered going in there. And I don't do the shades. His, his they do the shades. I don't do the shades. The you should do the shades, Jacob. No. Just saying, look, look at the boy. Didn't, he didn't write ads either. The first okay. Oh, you're, shut you're up, Snyder. Saying I'm challenging or you're not saying <laughs> no, I'm not, not going to win cheap. Okay. I'm not oh, going to win cheap. Okay. No challenge. That's all right. No, Next time, let's go. Oh, all right. I love okay. it. All right, right. Final, that is question. Fair. final question. Final question. Round week one, on gentlemen. The, um, Category is horror with, thriller. What's his name? Frank Darabont directed Thomas <laughs> Jane in which movie based on a Stephen um, King story? I don't even know this. Like this. Good movie. Horrifying ending. Five. Oh, horror Christian! Got three, three. Come on! Two. Come on. One. I think he's got and it. And Christian Harloff. The miss. Missed. Missed. Yes! Missed. Hey. Jeff is also gets the miss. And we have We're a tied. tie game after oh. round number one. Oh. Absolutely. Good, absolutely man. tie game. Uh, this is exactly what we thought we were going to get. All right, guys. And so, now yeah. we move into I thought maybe an extra round point. Round but number two. Like, yeah. Can it's still so both tip for tie. Absolutely wheel is being brought onto the field of play. Round two, as you know, can make or break Please let there be Star Wars on the wheel. Please let there be Star Wars on the wheel. Spin from the category wheel. Each competitor gets I wonder if questions. Spinner's choice is on the wheel. Are worth two points. Multiple choice Who is chooses that? Oh, that chooses that, right? The value no. of the question I to know. one point. I if a competitor if gives an incorrect answer, match, the, the champ chooses if they steal. want. No, so I think Karl tweeted out, uh, whoever the higher ranked opponent is can choose. All right, the Let's score do is tied, but Christian Harloff, you are the higher ranked competitor. You have the choice. Would you like to spin first or second? Yeah, I'm going to go first. All right, go it ahead. It is. Give the wheel a good yep. spin. I mean, that's but I go. don't spin think that was Star Wars yeah. on there, though. But I've seen it's a weaker spin. No, no. no fantasy sci-fi is on there, but not no, Star Wars. No, no. Okay. Oh, fantasy sci-fi. Oh. All right, wait, go, dude. If, if All right, go Christian's with going. Um, Christian is good. Um, Christian is good at scores and soundtracks. Your first yeah, question one of his strengths. Category fantasy sci-fi. Yeah. Who voiced Smog and the Necromancer? Benedict Cumberbatch. Benedict Cumberbatch. Benedict Cumberbatch. Uh, Benedict Cumberbatch. Correct two for points. two points. Ben Biscuit Cucumber. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Your second question in fantasy sci-fi. In the sci-fi classic Logan's Run, nobody is allowed to 25. live past what 30? age? No idea. 30? No. He has no clue. Correct for two oh! points. Oh, yes! <laughs> All right, he thought about it a second, oh. decided to take a stab at it, and it works. Let's go. All right. Come on. Your third question. Come on, man. Who played the pawn shop owner, Jeebs, in oh. Men in Black? Um, Monk. Tony um, Shalhoub. I know his yes. face. I know his face. Uh, Tony Shalhoub. Tony Shalhoub. Oh, I did not kill him. It it he good. seems to have had a strategy to try not good. to go to those multiple choice, and this it's paying good. off. Come on. This is good. Come on. All right. Your oh, yeah, final drink that question. With, uh, Ooh, <laughs> who played... Who played... Humble, Stardust. Tristan's romantic oh, rival my God. in the movie Stardust. Go to multiple choice. Uh, multiple choice. Yeah. All right. Is it A? Henry Cavill, B, James McAvoy, C, Henry Cavill. Jamie Bell, oh, it's, it's D, Henry Cavill. Charlie Cox. Uh, that's, Charlie Cox is the main character. Charlie Cox? Incorrect Charlie chance for a steal, Jeff Henry Snyder. Cavill. Can you repeat the... Uh, it's a young Henry a, Cavill. Henry Cavill, B, Wait, James McAvoy, Wait, Daredevil and C, Superman Jamie were in a movie Bell, together? D, Charlie Cox. Jamie Bell? Incorrect, we were looking for Henry Cavill. Wow. That's important, that's right, important. That, that Christian huge. Harloff takes a six point lead. It's a good lead, but it is not a huge that's lead. That's decent. Snyder's that's decent bad. with that category. Okay, but Jeff. we have to see what Snyder gets. Yeah, to go. your, your spin. He gets there opponent's is. choice. The scores and sound taxes for Yeah, totally. Let's get oh! 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 Hell yeah, baby! This could be a problem for Snyder. Oh my God! All right, Christian Harloff, you come on. Have go the for the six. Now to select the category that Jeff will go with. Which category are you picking? Scores and soundtracks. I got two. I got two. 
ways I can go here. I can knock you out of the park and give you comic book movies, or I can make it a fair fight and give you Quentin Tarantino. Oh. No. Knock him out. Knock, knock me out. Of we need an answer. We need an answer. In Scores and soundtracks. Five, four. Come on, Harlow. Three, two, one. Scores and soundtracks. Yes! Yeah! Soundtracks. soundtracks. That a boy. Right, four questions. All right, Jeff, you're up. Lauren, I'm sorry that I'm very excited, but soundtracks I feel for bad you. for you. Four <laughs> questions, first question. I feel bad for you guys' ears. Who composed the score for Road to Perdition, Finding Nemo, and Skyfall? Oh, oh um. Uh, Thomas um, Newman. That's correct. That's correct. Newman, yep. Two points. Well done. Question two. In Perks of Being a Wallflower, what David Heroes. Bowie song Heroes. blasts as Patrick and Charlie drive through the tunnel while Sam stands up in the back of a pickup with her arms outstretched. I'd use this word to describe the lion's den, heroes. <laughs> All right, correct for two points. Shit. Some would disagree, but the answer is I right. I would just called it the, what, what is the- Who composed the score for the, the action song? flicks, Lethal Weapon, Die Hard, and License oh, to oh. Kill? I thought you should hate it. Uh, multiple choice. I'm not good. A, Michael Kamen. B, Dave Grusin. Dave Michael C, Kamen. Randy Newman. D. Quincy Jones. Quincy Jones. Michael Kamen. That's correct for one point. Wow, this has not worked out the way Christian had hoped. Final question. <laughs> wow. In 2017's Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, Brandy. what song Brandy. did Ego um, yeah. say was about Which is himself a song. and. You don't know it. He does. I, I doubt he'll, he'll know this. You don't a, know. Fox on the Run. B. Brandy. C. The Chain. D. Father and Son. Is this too early to do? This question. They had a Wonder uh, Woman Father question and again. Man. Incorrect. Come on. Christian for Fox on the run. But Incorrect. it's oh, for a specific Brandy. question. Brandy. Like, that's not in the trailers. Brandy. Brandy by Looking Glass. I get. I don't know. All right, it's... John. Eleven to ten. That's, that's, that's a bigger right. conversation right. to have. That's a bigger conversation two, to have. The wheel gets taken away, and it is as yeah. close as we thought it this was going to be. Crazy. We now move. Into oh round number three. I didn't think that would happen. This is where the money would've... is made. I was just gonna kill him. Tom, this, this is this is the match that we were asking for. Oh! All right, John, we have a potential official challenge here. Tom Dagnino. The manager in there discussing it yeah. with them. All right. Because uh, the the wording of the question threw him off my answer, I am gonna officially challenge. He's going to officially All challenge. Right. Wait, what? What's he, challenging? What's he challenging? What's the wording of the question. So, Jeff Snyder has uh, issued a challenges match in conferring with a third judge. We have decided to uphold the challenge, and Jeff Snyder will be getting a new question. Wow. Wow. What's the wording of it. Of the Guardians. Thank you, judges. I Thank you. Maybe it's because I knew it, but I didn't. Good move having a manager. Now when people ask why you have a, a manager, bad I guess that's wording. Why you have a manager. <laughs> All right, Jeff, your Thanks, fourth Rocca. and final Appreciate question. It. Besides the first two Terminator uh, right, films, I'm a, I'm a the James Cameron movie had its score composed by Aliens. Brad Fire. Aliens and the Abyss. Oh, come on. No. I'm upset now. I'm, I'm Multiple choice. A, The Abyss. <gasps> Good. B, Thank God. Lies. C, Alien. Right. D, Avatar. Oh, Just true lies. That's correct. Correct for one. For one. Oh. That was a big challenge because that meant oh, yeah. Schneider had now the Corner? opportunity Who to tie the match. The absolutely, absolutely. That makes me upset. That actually makes me a bit upset. I don't think that uh, comes uh, to uh, guys, worse. Let us go into it's round the game three. I know, but this went is for review. Oh, it was a fair team. challenge. You, uh, know the rules, but I'll fair explain it here. Competitors will pre select from wrong. 20 categories. 20 cat categories. Each competitor will get three questions. Salty questions Evan. Two, three, and five <laughs> points. There is no yeah, stealing in this round. It is a tie game, John. So, the higher ranked competitor. Yeah, I don't know. Go for okay, numbers, guys. Numbers, we are only 27 one, minutes through this video. This triple threat match one, can't be this long. Three. Jeff Schneider, you're up. There might be a break or something. No. Nah. Nah. 12. Sam Stone. 18 no. and 6. Just your, your clarification, your second I number was 18? So. 12, 18, and 6. There we go, 12, 18, I, and 6. I so. Can I challenge that? <laughs> <laughs> All right. right, Jeff, you selected uh, number 12. That corresponds to the category of crime. Crime. Two-point question. He'll know this. He'll know this. Sam Mendez directed which film that turned out to be the last feature film role of legend Paul Newman? Road to Perdition. That is correct. Two points. Jeff goes into the lead. 
We now jump over to Christian Harloff to try to tie the match. Christian, the first number you selected was the number one. That gives you the category of sports films. He might know this one. Your two point question under the category sports films. Come on. What sport is the focus in 2000? Yeah. Bring it on. Cheerleading. I was going to say dancing at first. But it's fun. All right, absolutely. Like on, the crowd said, go Toros. On, uh, Jeff. Jeff. <laughs> Number 18. That is the category of Tarantino films. Oh. Tarantino films. He knows this. Three point cut. question. We don't know. What wind instrument does Bill play while sitting outside the church where Beatrix is getting married? It's a um, not a guitar. But I, he's playing a, a, a saxophone. A wind instrument, you said? Can I, can you read no, yeah, question? it's a wind what instrument. What wind instrument does Bill play? A woodwind, while like a saxophone, a flute, a clarinet. Oh, Beatrix right, is getting no, married. It's the harmonica. I can't remember. No, that is incorrect. Um, incorrect. Flute like a, for flute. Yes. Yeah. Flute. Okay. No steals of course. Wooden flute. There. So I was gonna guess right. and say flute. Right, Let's go. Come on. Now. Yeah, I was gonna say, isn't that a wood <sighs> instrument? A flute? Then, I mean, a, a flute is a wood instrument. You can oh, Google that. God. Are you challenging? Challenge. It's challenging. Oh, he is challenging. He is challenging. Yeah. He's going officially. Oh, right. challenged. This one's not gonna. He's not getting he's away not with it. He's not getting away with this one. Come on. Sure. Come on, right, guys. Because the last Jeff one, was successful in his challenge early in the match, he was allowed to issue another challenge. He did. The judges have conferred, and the ruling stands. Thank you. The ruling stands. Thank you. Thank you. Jeff Finally, now good decision. That's a good decision. Okay. All right, Christian. Oh. You chose the number five for your three-point category. That corresponds with the category Hit this. of Arnie and Sly. Yes! Movies. Oh! Come on, baby. <laughs> yes! For three oh. points and the lead. Who what? played the model Ingrid that gets taken into protective custody by oh. Marion Cobretti in the Stallone flick Cobra? Oh. Shut up, JT, because you know as well as I do, it's Bridget Nielsen. <laughs> yes. All right, now we There's go no back way. To Jeff There's Spider's no way. If he misses this, I... Christian Harloff will be the new number one contender. Absolutely. I will point out, Jeff. <laughs> this is, is the opposite of what Christian wants. Thank God, huh? This is right. not the output Christian, Christian wants. Jeff, this is what I said would happen. Six. That is the category of Oscar movies. Oscar movies. Five uh, point he's question. He's probably going to know this. What two actors won an Oscar for playing the same character? Um, Brando. Uh, sorry. Repeat um, the question. Uh, Robert De Niro what and Marlon Brando. Marlon Brando. An Oscar for playing the same oh, oh, character. I... Marlon Brando and Robert De Niro. That's, That's correct. That's correct. Oh, oh God. Please say Star Wars. Just say Star Wars out of your mouth. So it comes down to this. Come on, the third time Say three Star Wars today, sounds like comes down to the something. final question. If Christian on, Harloff correctly on. answers, he is the number one contender. If he misses, on, Jeff please. Schneider continues his hot streak, and he will be the Stop number talking, one Campia. contender. Stop talking, Campia! Christian, <laughs> for your five-point question, the, you win simply with the number three. That corresponds with the category of scores and sounds. Oh, yes! Oh, no. oh, this is going to be a best in moment. This is going to be best in Shut up, no, Jacob! <laughs> That's the thing. Oh, right. Your five-point question be. for the win. In Star Wars, I'm kidding. That probably took for off the nerves. Five points. Here we go. What esteemed composer was nominated for an Academy Award for his score on the movie *L.A. Confidential*? Thanks, Newman. This is one of Jacob's favorite films. Damn it. Damn it. Did she not know it? I can hear the comments already. Jerry Goldsmith. And your winner and number one contender, Christian! Oh! Oh! oh my god! Oh yeah, baby! John yes! Let's go! Yeah! I also have all the first.
first one to give Christian shit for winning this match. And if you're in the Take Three Productions page, I will personally ban you from the group. You can't make this up. You can't fix this. This is how you do it. And oh my god! Amazing match. <laughs> All right, hey guys, here we are no? with our. I'm so sorry for everyone's eardrums. <laughs> oh my god! Tender Christian Harlow. Right, just. Hey, buddy. Cool. Guys, how's it going? Grace? I'm sorry. All, I don't even know why, how you were here. I'm sorry. Emma Five is supposed to be standing here. Yet uh, uh, you're here. I guess homie lost her schedule. Unprofessional. Sure, sure, sure. What do you got um, for me, Grace? All right. Yeah. Um, what's going on? What do you mean? Arnie and Sly. Scores and sounds. Oh. Come just, on, let me start come right on. I, oh. A lot of weird wording. A lot of weird challenges. You can, well, What's the challenges on? are on your boy. That guy's challenges. Is, as he, as is this is my right. car challenge? He's getting shady. Um, what I was telling you. Is this my car challenge? When both of those came up, I said, "Oh." Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm telling you because when I was sitting there and I'm like, because I knew it. When I heard that Jerry Goldsmith question, I said, I either. Miss this, and then they go, Oh, he knew it. You're gonna or throw your go, own match just to try to clear your name. That's kind of where it came down to. It was either, it was either oh. junk it, get it wrong, and them going, Oh, he knew it, but he blew it, or take the comments and bring it on. Take All right, the well. Uh, it was a good match. It was a good match. Um, I think my my disappointment is clear, yeah. but it was a good match. It was a good match. It was pretty close. <laughs> there was a lot of going back and forth. Um, you still have an hour And now you're a number left. one contender. You're going to be this triple threat match going up against up. somebody two from later this year. How do you feel about that? I mean, in it's, August, like I said, I, I legitimately don't because because want there's something else in this thing. There's another curveball getting thrown. Z Rivera, there's a lot of black at the end of this to trick all of us. No, there won't be. So now gotten lucky. I've gotten lucky. So uh, <laughs> this is your last interview you're ever doing, by the way. So <laughs> going to be, it's going to be uh, myself against either Riley, Merle, yeah. or Roki. Um, I got to be honest. Oh, or Levine. I think that Any I'm one of those would be an interesting matchup. Yeah. Because okay. Roka three. I owe him. You owe him more. I owe him. He's beaten me once yeah, before. Roka He's too. the only guy that I haven't beat that's beaten me before. So I, I, I'd like to see Roka get the strap. Okay. But... Now, because I just said that, I am not going to be able to uh, at least look at the questions <laughs> when I uh, when I do the match when I call the match. Oh well, that yeah, I think that would be a good start. Right, but anyway. All right, <laughs> well, good. Mr. Harloff, the commissioner, congratulations, Thank you, Grace. good game. Right. We're looking forward to you contending for that title. <laughs> this feels like a big brother, little <laughs> sister yeah, uh, like situation. All right, guys. So here we are with my boys, the Lions Den. Just, that was not our to most shiny moment. <laughs> this is the biggest joke in history. Oh, the biggest God. joke. <laughs> and we have somebody who wants to talk about it. His name is Mark Antrico. I've tried to be the nice lion for a very long time, and now I'm fucking pissed. <laughs> the whiteboard. <laughs> write the title of the movie. Spelling doesn't count, but write the title. As good as it gets. Not good as it gets. The as in that title isn't like the in The Exorcist. Right. It's the first. You could have challenged it. Alphabetized under the letter should've A. should have challenged so, it. So that's bullshit. Should've. Correct. And, and I don't think it changes two, the the decision though. It's one point. Peter, this song Brandy is about me and your mother. Right. He says what the question is. Later he says mm. we're like the sailors in this song, but never once does he say it's a song about us because then it would be about his his father. It was a fair you got the challenge. You got the challenge. Shut it's up. Which is very weird. Why? So I just want it's like a fair challenge. against us from the very top. Well, the rules need to be consistent rules. These are these fly by night rules where we'll change it after that isn't fair because <laughs> right. this has nothing to do with the win. I'm annoyed because it's my team, but I I have fought. I have fought for other people when they when they're. Well, it's also that, like that. It's also that one time Campia screwed you on the same thing. Oh, it's happened twice. Yeah. It's happened, to me. it happened when they mispronounced John Houston's name as the director. Yep. of Andy. They're like John Hudson. Absolutely. Like, Stop. Who, who the fuck right. is John Hudson? We just keep getting we screwed. Do your research. It's so frustrating. <laughs> Can I get oh, a Draco, yes. I love you. Jeff. There, listen, there's a whole bunch of stuff I could complain about. My first spin and Christian stopping the spin because it was a garbage spin. Who is he to decide? Oh, again? they cut that again? out. And then I get to spin again, oh. and it's a bonus choice. Oh well, what do you know? So he had that oh, advantage, oh. okay? He picked scores in the soundtracks. He thought that was going to be a weakness. Turns out I got as many points as him in the second yeah, round. Yeah, you killed Here, it. Here's another thing. You Google flute. Type everyone, pull out your iPhone and type in the word flute. And you know what comes up? <laughs> flute. 
wood instrument. I'll okay. It's a flute. Wind it's a wood wind. There's a lot of wood instruments flute. Wait, deciding on, stuff. Second. The flute that he is, Guys, that he is it's playing. It's the lion's den. Do you think they're Bill not going to try to find as many things Fu, wrong with this match? Which is a hand carved wood instrument. So it's not technically a flute. It's a woodwind that he made into a flute. So they, they, what they should have said is woodwind. He said it's a woodwind that he made that into a flute. Right I don't know who's um. writing these questions, but I'm pissed. Uh, oh, Skaliski. Better than Christian Arlott today. He was. Listen, his last answer was very impressive. I thought he was going to miss it. He pulled it out of his ass somehow. Good for him. But, uh, you know, I may have left some, left some points on the first round, uh, left some points on the table in the first round. Right. But, ugh, this is, but this then is you a really, crushing you started disappointment. To warm up. He's I gotta, I gotta coming back, I'm gonna be able, He's, I'm gonna be he's the coming back. <laughs> this is not to take away from what Christian did. Christian's super smart and super good at this. But having him say spin again while well, he's a contestant, that should have been thrown out. For any team and any player, the rules need to be consistent, and the rules need to be the rules for everyone. I didn't know until today when you spun opponent's choice. I'm like, well, that was his first spin. Can't he spin again? Every time well, I've been told that's been a rule. That's been a rule. That's rule. been a rule since last year, Andrejko. Don't even fucking go there. There's something wrong with Zed Mark here. Slide Arnie scores the soundtrack. Yeah. Arnie scores the soundtrack. I'm leading investigation. And then we can't be, and then we can't be led with the Star Wars question. I thought he was serious because I thought I was like, oh, here's another layup for Harloff. Oh, this is the you special program. We got this is the special <laughs> program that we've been talking about. Yeah, this I'm, is it. exactly. This has to be the special program from the commissioner. Correct. I'm gonna come back stronger right. than ever, Grace. Yeah, guys, you have my word. This You're is not gonna break us. Imagine if it ends up being a protest, us. and if we're not afraid of these bullshit. It's gonna be a trial. And the Snyder yeah, wins, they pissed. play and hover, hover while you bend this match. The only way Why? people can beat us it is won. when they cheat. That's it. it. Oh, shut up, Tom! Definitely shady maneuverings going on today. Jeff, you will always be our champion. I like Finn Stock, but right now, just shut your whore mouth. Guys, there's still an hour and thirty minutes left. You guys are so there is something else going on. I'm uh, playing with you. I promise you, boys. I'll give my word. Ooh. The title's coming over to here. Bennett's not there. Okay. Horseman for life. He's been away. He's working on a project. He's, yeah. like, He's working on an accident, isn't he? I believe so. So that's why he yeah. hasn't. He's actually yeah, been best, away. From what I've heard, he hasn't been on Heroes in a while. Go. All right, guys, I don't want to sound too speculative, but there's an hour and 30 minutes left. I know. Yeah, well, Levine is probably but... showing off. Okay. That was the first time I ever had heartbreak. My way back up. Either way, I want another shot at the belt. I'll go the long way. I'll take the short way. It doesn't matter. This is my destiny. This is what people need to understand. And I want all the records. I want all the belts. I want all the records. And your winner, <laughs> and the new Oh, uh, that was the best reaction. Yeah. Was, well, yeah, I have to say that was... Emotion, man. Yeah. yeah. I'm a huge... People need to understand, Roka is my number two. Ryder's my number one. Roka is my number two. So that was a great moment for me as a Roka. I'm not scared of anybody. You line them up. I knock him down. That's how it works. I beat a murderer's row to get here. Whoever's coming up, JTE, yeah, great. Bring him on. Who else you got? Riley, I beat him twice already. You line him up, I knock him down. That's how it works. This outlaw that thinks he's some kind of cowboy that rides in on some pink felt horse and has friends that call himself four horsemen doesn't deserve to wear that belt. So only God can destroy me, Riley. And no histrionics or yelling or showing off. That was so good, Enchant. That's a, such a good Enchant. Get inside that cage, my friend. It's you and me for five rounds, if you even make it that far. And your winner! Oh yeah. I'm shocked. I'm shocked. I'm shocked. And I beat you, you once. Dan next. For a year, I fought my ass off to get a shot at Dan, and I beat him. I don't make those decisions, but I'm happy Sir, I got you really upset when they called the triple this? threat That's here. The I'm excited for it now. I've been fighting my ass off. I was really upset by the decision, though. And I, I didn't got there. Call it. And I beat Dan. I'm excited. I'm excited about it now, though. Three times. I beat Mark Riley three times. There's no way I don't deserve a shot, a rematch at that belt again. So he's gonna give me a shot at that belt at Collider Collision. We're gonna make this a triple threat. It's ridiculous that I lost this belt on a fluke to Mark Riley, And I want my belt back. I want that belt. Harloff, are you listening? Commissioner, I want that belt. I will be competing. I will be here. I will be ready to play. Uh, so I, I take it that uh, Roka wants a girdle. Coming at the end. <laughs> being the champ and if I can be the champ on more than one front I'm happy to do it I want that belt back and I'm gonna get it
Nice. Who's the favorite? Huh? Who are you all going for? I'm going for Roka. I want Roka. Roka is my You know what? I want you know Roka. what? If, if Roka loses, Listen there is a chance we get Mance Roka 3. It's the outlaw. With nah. the rock, the Ooh. great one, Dwayne Johnson. No, because of the tournament. Tell me what I'm going to do to them. Here's what he's going to do. He's going to raise his right hand. Then he's going to raise his left hand. Then he's going to lay it to smack <laughs> it down on both your candy asses. <laughs> not three times. <laughs> not four times. This is what they were hiding. About 12 times. Yeah. Okay, I failed math. <laughs> Fuck it. About 12 times. He's gonna lay the smack down. Spring Junkies, Collider, yeah. right? Dan yeah. Merle, Mark Riley. Yeah, but I don't give a fuck what their That's names right. are. That's right. Pretenders with a ass. He's gonna kick your ass and he's gonna remain the champion. <laughs> wow. They have been sitting on that for a long time. They have been yeah. sitting on that for a long time. It's not worth it. What are we fine with it? This is super young. If we get the Roka that that's relaxed and not like not the outlaw Roka, I'm cheering for Roka. If we don't, then I'm cheering for Riley. We'll get, sorry, you're gonna get the outlaw Roka. The table. Yeah, that's Are you what? sure? Riley Finn. The way how they were talking about it <laughs> post match. This year, quick thoughts on the match. Oh, no, man. I'll tell you, man. When I was sitting up there and I said it in the post with that uh, scoundrel Grace, um, I uh, I was back <laughs> here when I got that question. I knew it. I heard all those freaking comments and I said, you know what? I was always taught, go in, fight, win it, uh, in, and win. Don't worry about what other people say. So I won the match. Well, you know, you're, that on, he did. you're mm -hmm. on a terrific hot streak yep. right now. We're looking forward to seeing what you do. But now the big question is... He's sizing up his and, competition. And, I've, and, and I, I mean what I say. If now. I see anybody from the Take 3 page say that this whole thing was fixed and rigged, the title I'm kicking you out. This league, going I'll personally do it. I honestly oh, don't no, just don't take a Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, we can give him a stern talking to you. I'm sick of him. I'm sick of him. Uh, yeah, I'm kicking him. This excited. Yeah, yeah I'm with Jacob and Chris. I mean, the crowd alone. Seriously. Here, they're all excited about it. They're if he weren't to fix it, it he would have been the champ in 2014, the okay? I mean, no, he wanted to fix it. And if he wanted to fix it now, he would have lost. Who was the first person yeah. to yeah. ever hold the title, won yeah. that tournament back in 2014, yeah. wins four straight matches, defends it against JTE, and then he loses it to who? Dangerous Dan, Dan Merle. Merle. Dan Merle then goes on to become this dominating Mike Tyson-like force that's just ripping through people, and, and he had two title defenses, and, and spectacular, and it looked like no one was going to beat him. Enter John Roca. John Roca then beats Dan Merle, and then Riley takes the title back from Roca. And this is the last way. They literally have just been passing it to thing. each other. And what yep. I can also tell you guys is the Hence stipulation why this here, needs to happen. Roca kind of but, yeah. did force his way in into it a little bit, but because of what he did for the league, yep. what Merle did for the league, they got the immediate rematch. And what is going to happen? Whoever loses this match today, whatever two competitors lose. They will have to win three straight matches before they even get a shot at another title shot. And wow. that's a huge. No, so that's in the tournament. That, like, I, I don't think people realize this. They they just get thrown into the tournament. Anyways. I'm so excited. I decided to fly the center. Yeah. Team this coach the stakes on his high. Oh, this is great. Uh, win three uh, matches in the tournament. These, like I said, these are these Physically, are the they founding can't. fathers, building blocks of this league. Like mathematically, the they can't. This is like the guy so one of them's down not from getting there to fight and eventually lose to Wonder Woman. Well, we're going to find out who's going to be Dean the Champion in just a little bit here. We're going to show you guys how it all came to be right now. Well, here we are. It's all come down to this. The three best people in the Schmodown, in the history of the Schmodown, top of the mountain, Mount Rushmore, <sighs> here today, playing in one match. No, I've been dancing with I'm, Mark I'm, I'm very well aware my Dan hair is Merle very disheveled, but uh, you guys have to forgive me. I'm six and one. It's been a long day. Those guys. Are you stressed out? <laughs> Any variation. I am as well. <laughs> That's crazy. He's six and one against Merle and Riley. Riley got lucky yep. I've got some, uh, oh, by the way, my predictions now are three and one. I'm three and one on my predictions. I'm now really? two I'm and four two. for four. If you know the outlaw, the worst thing you can do is beat the outlaw. Because all he does is come back. More if Riley wins, then I'm four and one. And I'll be happy about that. I'm hungry, you know? I came I in just here, realized I if Riley wins, I got all my predictions. Right, I'm five for five. Played a good game. Didn't take it. Played a good title match against Roka. Didn't take it. I'm tired of not winning. I'm here to do what I do best, and that's win. I've beaten Roka. I haven't beaten Dan Merle. Dan Merle is a champion. He always will be. He's one of the best competitors that ever played the game. But that's one of those guys that I want to beat. 
I can't imagine a better match between three titans than myself, Riley, and Roka. I won the belt. So we've seen Riley. the spectacular in the belt from me. We've seen Riley the free for all. From Roka. I have to admit, I, think I feel like the only this way is the most this pay per view like one that we've seen. One on one, yeah. mm. may the best man win. But it's also it's because tough. of the up production value. Find out who the so. Best is. When the spectacular comes at the end of the year, that's gonna be something. Places you don't want to talk about. And it'll be even better you know because we'll be there. <laughs> wake up your girlfriends at 3 a.m. and you're you got sweating. You. I'll be in. You're like Rocky be before the match. I just want to make it to the final round. <laughs> then watch tickets maybe will be like 1,200 bucks, and you'll be like, uh, okay, maybe, maybe like I should go. Because I know who the best is, and I'm gonna prove it today. No one else in this league can claim what I have. Two, two belts. I'm a two-time champion. Nobody else. I haven't seen a single competitor coming up the chain yet. I see Merle. I see Roka. That's who I see. And that's why we're playing. And that's why I'm excited. <laughs> Mark Riley, outlaw John Roka. I got something to say to you. Last few matches, you know what I did? I got lost in the stage lights. I got distracted. I got distracted by the spectacle. I got distracted by the t-shirts. I got distracted by the new moral order and the smashing of the glasses. But you know what? That is over. That time is done. Oh, I got the glasses this back. is scary. I'm wearing the same thing that I won the first time I played this game, and that means that I'm not here to be funny. I'm not here to put on a show. <laughs> I'm not here to build a faction. I'm here to win. And that's what I'm going to do. Oh, that's Dana scary. Marco, you were great champions. You had your time. But your time is over. It's time for the outlaw. Only for the sake of getting Roka Harlop, too. I, I kind of want Roka to win now. All right, guys. I don't even. It's the final countdown. I just don't want Dan to win. Like, I Roka, don't want Dan to win. I have a lot of respect for you. This is going to be one hell of a match. I'm here. I'm bringing my best game. I know you guys are bringing your best game. For that, bring it on. I cannot wait. Schmowdown, it's the match for the ages right here. I want your best! <laughs> who? Get, listen, get, get, the two up. people who lose cannot get attacked because they're. The, the three best players are playing each other. So it's What's like, up, if you lose, in this week on you the lose to the best this right now. Is the main event. Triple threat okay. action. For the Schmodown Championship. The I'm time. talking about Riley, <laughs> the two time champion and reigning champion. They have something up their sleeve. Roka versus Merle. Now, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be perfect. This is 101, 202, 303, triple threat competition, man. I'm talking about pressure, Riley. You're gonna have to go back to the man that you wore back in 2014. You're gonna have to bring it, man. You're gonna have to. What's the song? <laughs> I play to win. <laughs> You're gonna have to do it, man. <laughs> oh, but Roka. Let me tell you something, man. Roka's hungry, man. He's real hungry. He is. He's coming off of a, a loss last Tuesday, but he can get himself back together. He's going to have to do it. He's going to have to do it. And he's going to have to do it quick. With biopics and dramas. <laughs> he's the best at that. If he can do that, we may be looking at a new champion dog. Someone can test that well better at uh, dramas than Dangerous okay. Dan. Oh my goodness, Dangerous Dan, we haven't seen this man since he lost the title. But let me tell you something, like that movie. Da, 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 <laughs> He's got that eye of the title, man, he can do it. But let me tell you something, it's like one of those wrestling matches, man. He's gonna have to make this thing a Donnie Brook. He's gonna have to make it a free fall, and we might see a new champion, perhaps. But for me, if I had to put my money on it, I'm going to Roka. Mm. Oh. Hello. I kind of I'm thought that was going to happen. Booker T. I'm going to win. Down, champion. The small down. Hey, guys, this Booker T. Five time champ. I Every Sunday. personally would love for it to come down to Riley and Roka. Roka. Reality of wrestling. Yeah, I don't Reality want Dan to wrestling. win. Hey guys, check it out on YouTube every Sunday. And like I don't I know what it is. Say, I like that? Dan. It's just I would Suck rather Ryler Roka be the champ. Hashtag keep the belt at Clyder.
That's I think right, that's kind of why. Go. I mean, you see Roca, he's running his mouth. That's what Roca does best. <laughs> Riley and Merle, you saw a little bit of that behind the scenes. They have a very, they have a good mutual respect. These are former teammates, by the way. Yes, they are. And they have a, they have a mutual respect for each other. There's no oh my God, I remember that. Between Riley and Merle, it's yeah, about team champs. It's, it's, it Roka, no, they never got champs. They got beaten by. Um, it is, and he's also, but he's no, that was their and, oh, they were team champs. Because yeah, Riley was the Schmodown champ, Merle was. Titles back, and I wonder how's that going to yeah. well, the it's not just fights. that, but I can tell you, it has. Can't believe he still has that belt. We know he wants to be. I can. That was a tough loss for him. Oh, I, yeah. Just Mark Riley, how long he's not had having it. Yet. Roka doesn't think his mission is yeah, done yet. He knows he never defended that title. It has sat in his mouth. Is he on a mission from God, God too? Is yeah. he going to be dressed as a nun? It's funny because he and Merle, not having the greatest of years, Merle lost the championship. Merle lost that bout against, with me and Roka. Right. And, and he's not having the greatest of years. Someone who is, Mark Riley. He won. He beat, he beat his partner, Clark Wolf. He beat Sam Levine, and he beat Roka. So he's coming off a high point. I'm ready to get going. This is the best of the best. All right, so Ken, are you ready to go? Uh, I'm absolutely ready to go. All right, here's the tale of the tape. As you see, John Roka, his strengths are biopics, Oscar These graphics movies, are amazing. talking until he falls asleep. <laughs> <laughs> then you have dangerous Dan Merle. Strengths are Spielberg movies, Oscar staring movies, into and staring into your soul. Into your soul. <laughs> and then finally, the champion Mark. He's never knocked Ryan anyone out. He's got Star Wars movies. Wow. Who? Ryan has like best three knockouts. Ryan has three knockouts. Right, so yeah. Oh, okay. They, they just didn't have it there. I'm ready yeah, they didn't yeah. put it there. Yeah. But Ladies it's just like how they didn't put Jeremy's loss. Here we go, the main event. Five rounds for the championship of the world. Introducing first. Oh, God. Representing the four Merle. horsemen. Oh, it's his rocker. No, it's With going by of six rank. wins. He yeah. goes Three two, one, champ. He is the 2016 Ultimate Schmodown finalist. The I wish he was wearing the suit. Trivia Schmodown team yes, champion, wait, he said he's trying to be more relaxed. Movie trivia Let's Schmodown see. Singles you know. champion, the Outlaw, John Ruka! Oh, no, he's not wearing it. Oh, no. <laughs> team action. Very different. Noticeably absent is the Roka mask. There is no Roka yeah. mask. Yeah. There's no Roka no horse wow. no suit. Wow. Just appears with Wonder Woman. Let's have oh my god, people. Let's go. Smow down. Let's make it happen. All right, look All at right. that. Roka popping up the crowd. Just Ken, yeah, I'm going for Roka this match. Ken. Sorry. Let's keep the barbs above the board. Okay. It's great to see you. You know, when a man That's in fair. jeans and a vest tells me that, I believe it. Let's That's right. do it. Coming out next. I'm going for Roka. It's official. Representing okay. Screen Junkies with a record. Of five wins, one defeat. He is the 2016 Schmodown Player is of that the Roka Year laughing? and the former <laughs> movie trivia Schmodown Champion of the World, Dangerous Dan Murrow. He just walked straight in. Is he? He's there to just play, like he said. He wants to be fast there. You cannot overstate how he big doesn't of a role Dan has played whatsoever. in building this he entire league. Oh, he wants, he, he wants it. He wants it. He wants us to stop talking. Wow. That's about he I could feel that. <laughs> right now, <laughs> Holy shit. And finally. I could feel that. Representing. How? Oh, 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 God. Yes. With a record <laughs> of nine wins, three defeats. And three knockouts. He is the 2014 Ultimate Schmodown winner and the two time champion, the reigning, defending, undisputed movie trivia Schmodown champion of the world, Mark Yodi Riley. Oh, fuck oh. yeah. Coming out with the lightsaber and the Jedi robe. Nice. The champion is here. 
looking straight nice. down the barrel. And again, absent is his normal Superman motif. Yeah. He's banded that for a little bit now. He's kind of switched. Yeah, I'm going for Roka. It has helped me. You know what? You it's said funny, that. I can't remember I know. getting into a title match here at the Schmodown. Oh my God. This oh, is here insane. it comes. Okay. Where the oh. champion wow. has been this much of an underdog. Well, if you follow the polls online, what people yeah. say. Oh! 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 He's the champion for a reason. Just different color. Right now, I mean, the guy has won three in a row, and then he's he's beaten John Rocha, and, and now he it's because smoke. They've got all the smoke in it. That he can beat both it's trouble. Fire okay. hazard. So, round number one is gonna work like this. The competitors will get eight questions. They will all write yeah. it down. They will go down reveal it when it's time to I will reveal. say that I get one point this you guys remember the round one. E rule. I'm calling it, I get five. I reckon I get two. These are going to be you difficult. Can I can't call it because I'm on a whiteboard, so. I look at it. These graphics guys are on another level. If you you lose your challenge. If you answer all eight questions correct in the first round, you'll get a bonus question worth one point. All right. Wait. Yeah. Something's in my head. I'm sorry. Something's in my hat. What? It's been a while. Oh, oh shit! Oh. Do it. Bring it out. That is a smart time to bring it out. It has been a while since he's done oh, this. Oh, God. This is for those of you who never joined this the first time so watching. So you can't this see, right? This is the real. Yeah. <laughs> you can't see? You can't see. Okay, first good. time watching this nothing. This is a sequel to uh, Fifty Shades. This is actually yeah, this is John Roca. Natasha, Natasha, now Natasha I might ride. need you again. He's got a ride. John Roca. Oh, my God, yeah, that's now right. this, we saw him use this tactic before. It helped him focus. It helped, and it because the last him time he did this, the okay, whiteboards so, weren't in. Dan Merle, play. Yeah. my favorite match of all yes, time. Sir. He John brought it back. Roca, are you ready? Oh, I'm so ready. The champion, Mark Riley, are you ready? Have I'm ready. fun, Riley. Right. Then let's get, get ready to Schmodown. For the Schmodown Championship. Okay, and guys, this one's sorry. I'm, right, I'm not even sorry about your ears. First category, the category of animated films. Which comedian voiced comic book fan and team mascot um, Fred in Big Hero oh, what's 6? His name? I don't know. No. Now, That's... Course, uh, have to, uh, adjust she, adjust yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, Probably not right. One. Pens down, Dan Merle. Oh, not right. TJ Miller? Damn it! Oh. Oh. Silicon Mark Valley guy. Miller. Correct, John Roca. TJ Miller. Look at that. Correct, right. across one. the board. Here we go. Okay, wow. John. Great start. All right, guys, your second question comes to you in the form of the category comedy. Oh, I hate this category. In this 2013 <laughs> comedy, okay. Seth Rogen, Jay Burchell, James Franco, oh, and others star oh. as themselves during the apocalypse. Oh, I got this. <laughs> yeah, this is right. Four. One pence down the champion. This is the end. This is the end. This is the end. Correct. Roca. This was called that at one point, and then they changed it before they released it. Did you expect anything else? What was it originally called? So far. Here we go. Sorry, it was originally called the end of the world, and then they changed it to this is the end. Bugging out gets upset when a pizzeria wall of fame doesn't represent black actors in what landmark drama slash comedy? Matt Ghost? My picture's up. I, I thought more people would laugh at that joke. <laughs> My apologies. Uh, um, uh, um, Four, three, two, one. Pens I'm down, blanking. please. Damn, do the right thing. I just ran do out of right time. Thing. Yeah. Fuck. Do the right thing. Correct. Yeah. I just thought I'd still pissed it in Draco. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And, and Riley. Do the right thing. There you go. Oh! Right. Yes, so down. keep the belt at Collider. Roca get a one. Roca take All right. out into the lead. All right. That means absolutely nothing. <laughs> <laughs> True. It does not mean a damn thing. Right, guys, your fourth question. That means Merle can have in the form of action adventure. In which film in the Jurassic Park franchise are we introduced <laughs> to the Indominus Rex? Mel's favorite. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Merle immediately knew that one. That's also what my doctor says Perry. I have, John. Four, three. <laughs> Two, one, pens down, Dan Merle. Jurassic, Jurassic World. World. Uh. Jurassic World. <laughs> <laughs> Riley. It's a it's good a movie. Life. Jurassic World. You got yes. it. And Roca. Yeah, thank you. Roca. Oh, Jurassic World sucks. Yeah, all right. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. They all get it. <laughs> Riley and Roca have not missed yet. All right. Yet. Category of horror. Now watch, they're going to miss. Thriller. Uh -huh. 
What gory 2005 horror movie sees travelers Josh? No, no, um, no, no, I refuse to know this answer. Deadly game after being lured into a Slovakian hotel by prostitutes. I can't believe I got that out. I can't believe that that actually happened to me. I was gonna is say, that I what I think it is? is? Yeah, that's based on my life. Most likely. Five, yeah. This movie actually isn't that bad. I mean, terrible. Riley. Part two uh, is awful. The sand lot and then crossed it oh. out and put <laughs> hostile. That is correct. Oh. <laughs> Uh, I was thinking it's all. Hostile. There you I go. Don't right, know. Yeah, yeah. Five. Four. I know. Wow. Okay. Next question. All right, guys. Now we move into the category okay. of fantasy sci-fi. Come on, baby. Rinko Kikuchi plays Mori, the female co-pilot in what Guillermo del Toro film? Oh, I. Oh. Oh. Mm. Dennis. <laughs> Five. Dennis, goddamn it! Oh, oh that's a out there. three. <laughs> Two, one, pens down, Roca. Um, Pacific Rim. Pacific Rim. I would sucks. challenge that because that's Pacific a hit. Rim is awesome. That's right. a hit towards Roca. No, Pacific Rim sucks. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you do? And there's no, a, because Dennis and Roca have a very specific relationship. Well, on, on, on movie talk about that, and they joke about it all the time, and Dennis says, you better know this. Who directed the album? He actually yeah, gave better know this actress in the movie. Um, fuck. Oh, God. Force of force skill. That was a bike race. I can't. All right, five, That's Tour de France. <laughs> four, three, um, not even gonna guess. Two, one pens down. Barry Levinson. Riley, pen down. And Merle. Just gonna say Sydney William Friedkin. Met? That's correct. correct. Oh, Sydney ah, okay. Met. Now there's just a bunch of you know things here that are wrong. Okay, <laughs> Roca. Sydney Lumet. Oh, oh my God. Roca. Come on, Roca. 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 So Roca has the opportunity here for a perfect first round. If Roca gets this question right, he has a chance for an extra point. All right, guys. Oh, the final Roca. question in round number one comes to you in the category of movie quotes. Ah, oh, shit. Shit. What 2004 comedy features the line, it's terrible, she has beautiful eyes, and her hair smells like cinnamon? Oh, um, is it? It's terrible. She has beautiful eyes, and her hair smells five, like cinnamon. Four, yeah, I know. Oh, oh. Just Number can't two, connect it to the actor Pandora. or actress. Right, here we go. I don't know. Got... No, I mean it's an actor. Though. In a glass cage of emotion, Anchorman. Ah, oh, oh, yes. damn it! Nothing. nothing broke. That's something playing dynamite. No, nothing. I put Dunn in. I put Dunn in. All right, he's missing the perfect shot. Dan, oh. Dan comes back and ties Roca seven seven. The champion. I got three points. Play one two. point here, and now we get oh. to round number two. Did you talk about blueberry hair or something? Here we go. I had the quote round right. Like I was, I, two. I knew, I had the voice. I just like couldn't yeah. connect it. Get a chance to spin the wheel. <sighs> you look like a blueberry. Why don't you go back to your home on Whore Island? To go with what All right, they how are they going to do this? I hate that movie. I mean, this the first time they have to All right, yeah. stick yeah. with what they get. And if yeah, worth two definitely. points a piece, you can opt for multiple oh. choice. Now, That's out. Oh my other God. two competitors will have whiteboards. They when will I was stressed out. Question <laughs> in order to steal. So after, if the competitor misses, the other two competitors will have a chance to steal at the very end of the question. So they're doing a lot of the game. Dan Merle, yeah. you are yeah. you are tied with Roca, but you are the higher ranked competitor at number one. Would you like to spin first, or go second, or even third? Um. Oh wow, that's a that's a yeah. choice. I'll go. For, I'll get out of the way. I'll go first. <laughs> yeah. All right, good All right. Good Dan's gonna go. All right. And Dan's showing off that confidence. Give, give it a good no spin. More. I was respect you as a champion. Sometimes it's good to put pressure on your opponent. There's the big spin by Dan. <laughs> there it goes. Imagine if Rick gets spinner's choice. He's gonna be like, "Crap, it what's on the board?" <laughs> I can tell you, I know sort of. If he does it like he did last time, oh my god! Oh, 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 yeah, I, can't, I can't be foolhardy enough to take his specialty. I gotta spin again. All right. All right. He right. thinks yeah. this is why he's like a champion. It. He yeah. thinks it right. through. He looks at Sound all the logic, angles. Dan. Sound logic. Yeah. Showed his work like a fourth grade kid in math. Well, yeah. look, yeah. he's either got right. spin his so choice now, or he's got animated or horror. Take whatever category he lands on now. Where's that gonna land? Where's that gonna land? It's gonna oh land. my! Oh, oh my God! Spinner's choice. Spinner's choice.
boys for Dan Merle. What a move oh, there by Dan. Boys. Dan's oh, no, he's got to go directors. Got that horror thriller again. Yeah. He's going directors. Biopics. Uh, I believe I will take comic book movies. Oh! oh. Nice. Okay. Sean Roca, yeah. Mark yeah. Riley. If, if I was going to take any category, it would be that. You guys write down. Dan is not writing down right now. You guys are writing down. And if he misses, then you will have the chance to steal. This is right. stress. Here we go. Dan Merle, your first no, question okay. in the category of comic book movies. What is the name of Loki's army in the Avengers? Ah, uh, Chitari. And, yeah, the Chitari. The Chitari. That's correct. correct. Two correct. points. Dan Merle getting nine points there. All right. It's only Dan, four questions, hey. In yeah. which Eastern yeah. European country was Magneto hiding in at the beginning of X Men? Oh. Apocalypse? Uh, Germany. X -Men Germany. Apocalypse. Correct. Oh, Apocalypse. Right. Yeah. Uh. I'm going to take multiple choice on that one. Smart A, East Germany. Good, B, good. Czech good Republic. Yeah, C, Poland. D, Romania. I actually think it's Romania. It's Poland. That's yeah, Poland. I don't Poland? know. Correct for one point. Right. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Two, more, two more questions for Dan. Nice Dan, who played the Green Goblin <laughs> in The Amazing Spider-Man 2? Oh, oh Dan DeHaan. Yeah, Dan DeHaan. Dane DeHaan. For two more points, Two Dan more Merle. points. Yeah. All he right. is not letting this go back to his opponents for possible steals. All right, your final on, question. Boy. Who directed The Green Lantern? Um, 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 Yeah, no. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, yeah. Campbell. Martin Campbell, yeah. Five. Martin Campbell. Oh, 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 oh wow. Dan My Merle Lord. with a great round there. Getting off to 14, 6, 7. Riley and Roka need to have strong. Riley can have a perfect turn and still be tied. Yep. Roka only has to hit 7 to be tied. Do you want to spin the wheel or you want Riley to spin? No, Riley, you spin. All right, he's giving it to Riley. Riley. Go to Riley. Champions, uh, champ goes first. Respect. Well, no Respect, courtesy. Big spin, spin is in, spin is in. What does he want? Riley. Like, this is why I'm confused. What he wants horror thriller. thriller. He wants horror That's thriller. That's what he wants. Broker will want by it. And he might get it. He's gonna get it. Oh! This is a championship match. This is a championship match. Are you sure? Horror thriller. Mark Riley choosing and keeping horror thriller. Okay. This is a freaking first question mark. He does miss Donald Pleasance's character in Halloween. Dr. Sam Loomis shares a name with a character from what classic 60s chiller? Psycho. For Correct two points. for two points. Oh okay. my god, let's go, let's go. I mark your second category under the category. Your second question under the category of horror. Right. Who plays the great vampire killer Peter Vincent in the nineteen eighty five oh. okay, that's um Fright Night? Who plays it in the who Well David Tan's the guy in the remake, but it's uh um, remake. Who plays um, the original. Yes. Yeah, I think he's gonna say repeat right. the question. Four. Is it A, oh, John really Roddy McDowell. There we go. Roddy McDowell. C, Fuck. Christopher Lloyd. Yeah, he knows it. D, David Warner. Roddy McDowell. Correct Ooh. for one point. Mark yeah. Riley playing okay. tough here. Oh, All right. that, that's got to hurt. Your third question. Not really. It's one point. Horror. But which 1980 horror but it puts in two stars Adrian Barbeau as local radio DJ Stevie Wayne? Oh. These are some deep cuts. I think he's going to go multiple choice again. Four, three, two, it's not five, these are one. Multiple deep choice. cuts. Is it A, The Fog, B, no, the fog. Friday the 13th, C, The Amityville Horror, or D, The Entity? The Fog? Correct for oh, one point. Right. Riley having a nice I, fight here. So oh, it's final question. These final are final deep question cut here. questions. Yeah, he that. has it this two pointer. But that's why Final that yeah that's it's mm -hmm. good because it's a spe it's a string so they do deep cuts for the strings. Yeah. John Travolta as a sound Oh um blowout. Records oh, yeah. a political it's a great movie. It's gonna go multiple choice again. Uh, multiple choice. Is it A, body heat? Wow. B, blowout. C, Nighthawks. D, Death Hunt. Nighthawks? <gasps> Incorrect for the chance to steal. So you guys have no. you, Write it down, Roka. You, you should have done it. Or you have five seconds. Five, four, three. All right. So, Dan, what do you have? Show me. 
B, blowout. And That's correct. Roka. B, blowout. So correct, two, yeah, one so point go. each. Merle steals, Roka steals, uh, so 15 uh, eight. That, that might cost the game. Yeah. Needed multiple choice, I know, but now it goes I, to John Roka. Oh John I love Roka, Riley, spin. but oh I think okay. big just, spin here. I've he did play it safe, but that steal is going to make a big difference now. That was good. There it is. All right, it's a good spin. This is my land on spinners. This is getting on spinners. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. god. Spinner's choice for Roka. I <laughs> bet you know where he's going. Right. I'll bring it up now. Biopics. Yes. Yeah, biopics. Biopics. Biopics it is. Oh, biopics. biopics it is. John this Roka is could have a serious stars. round here. A serious round. This like, is big. Here we go. Like John Roka, your yeah. first question. Round. Who it's played the title deep, role in the 1996 film Evita? Madonna. For two points, John Roca tying up Riley. Oh my oh, god. god for me, Argentina. <laughs> All right, who plays oh, the brilliant mathematician who studies under G.H. Hardy in 2016's um, 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 The Man um, Who Knew Infinity? Oh my god, Slumdog Moon it. Um, oh yeah, what's the... I'm sorry, can you repeat Death the question again? That's one of your Yeah, Death yeah, yeah, Who plays the brilliant mathematician who studies under no, G.H. Hardy No, I actually know it's not. 2016's The Man no, Who Knew right. Infinity. God, uh, I think I know, but I want to go multiple choice. Uh, is it A, Dev Patel? B, Ethan M. Oh, it is C, Dev Patel. Tom okay. Holland. D, Azer Butterfield. Dev Patel. Oh. Tom Holland. Oh, John Roca now okay. overpassing Riley. Spider-Man! All right. Sorry, sorry. Two Just more questions left. for John Roca. The 1993 film Shadowlands stars Anthony Hopkins as which famous author? Ooh. Uh, it's getting too You know what? Fuck it. You got to take chances in life. Uh, God damn it. C.S. Lewis? For two points. Oh, yes! yes. Oh! I love that movie. Wow. All right. That movie does not get enough credit. That this is a damn is it. good movie. Your last question here, Roka, to get right, within time. one point of Dan Merle. That doesn't put him in the Who big directed tie. the 1990 crime thriller Bugsy? Starring Warren, Warren Beatty. Beatty and Annette Bening. Yeah. Didn't he? Barry Levinson. For two points. Wow. Oh. Roka has just no, tied yeah, Dan no. Merle. Okay. So Merle and Roka are head wow. to head, and Riley <laughs> needs to catch up here. Riley's going to bet three points. Round. I think Riley gets two points. All right, Riley, all the members bet, three, it's the betting round. The so it's going to work like this. this. Dan this is Merle what I hate is, this is tied with Roka. So even if he hits it, spin, and if they both on, hit it, the he's still behind. Bet upwards to three points. The lowest they can bet is Hey, speed zero. round, Matt. Three points. I know, and they will be but asked a question, it's okay, and it is the but round But the speed round, counts, Merle killed him in the speed round in his title match against... And heads back over to the wheel. Right now. He's just so calm, cool, and collected when he plays. Good spin. He wants this. I can see yeah, he does. Face. He wants to, he, he's looking to get that belt back. Mm. He's going to make spinners again. On. Nope. Directors. 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 Drama. Oh, drama. Oh, drama. Drama. All right, so gentlemen, nope, you've heard that the category is drama. How many points do you want to bet on drama? Please go ahead and Broker's got to do place two. your bets. Broker, do two. Place your bets. He's going to win the game. Because, guns. You know, if you go big, you could go home. So, but that warm middle, John, that could hurt you. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Gentlemen, are you ready? Yep. All right. In what 2006 movie stars Emma Thompson as a writer? Um, as her Stranger and than Will Fiction. Farrell as the main yep. character. Tell me, Riley bet three points. They're all writing down feverishly here. Feverishly. Yep. It doesn't matter what he up. bet yep. if he and gets home. Five, well, actually, it does. Four. Three. Because he knew the answer. One, tell tell down, me Mark that Riley, he bet three points. How many points? Uh, two. And you bet. Uh, stranger than fiction. Yes, that's correct. Two points for Mark <sighs> Riley. All right, Roca. Yeah, it's another bet. bet. Two, I'm points. Through. two points. Stranger and than fiction. Two more points for Roca. Dan Merle, you bet. <sighs> two points. And you oh. chose. Stranger than oh. fiction. Two more points. So we're right back where we started here. Five point lead for both Merle and Roca. Riley now, the speed round is going to have to be big for it's Riley. It's the round. He made a strategic it's... error there. He's down by five. He needed to put down three points, regardless of how comfortable he was with that category. This Now he's made up no ground. He made no ground yep, so far, no but we'll ground. see. He, let's see how the speed round turns out to be. <laughs> Take it all. all right, guys, it's the speed round. We are <laughs> going to have five questions. Five questions here in the speed round. Each question is worth one point apiece. However, if they buzz in, they will have two seconds to answer the question. If they don't get it right, they will lose Absolutely, I'm edge my seat. So, guys, there's an guys, hour ready left. Yep. Ready. All right, here we go, guys. Something's happening. I know. Something's happening. Mary Ringwald's first starring role was as Samantha in which teen? 16 Violet. Candles. Uh, One. 16 Candles. That's, That's correct. correct. Ooh. Good, right, good, right, good, good boy. All right. Points. Guys, your second question. 
Forrest Gump goes into the shrimping business to honor what fallen comrade? Bubba. 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 Roca. Bubba. Correct. One point. <laughs> Come on, Roca. Okay. Name an actress that plays one of the wives and has a wife in the and 2005 and drama Michelle Williams. Brokeback Mountain. Merle. Merle. Michelle Williams. There you go. One point for Merle, tying it up with Roca. And we're back right. at square one. Question. What is the first name of Uma Thurman's character Mia. in the Tarantino yeah. film Pulp Fiction? Who is that? Roca. Roca. Oh, oh one, shit. One, two, lost point for Roca. Fuck! It was, it was, it was Mia. Mia. Mia was. All right, so Roca loses the point there, buzzes in. He did that yep, in the other match. I thought here we go, matrix. last last question here, last question. Damn it. Who played the president of the United oh, States Morgan in the film Deep Impact? M Merle. Morgan Freeman. Ah, Merle oh, now goes up by God. two points here after that speed round. Oh, Movie oh. fights paid off. You can see that. It's that oh, speed round. Merle is really good in. Today. All Sorry, right, Dan. ladies and gentlemen, yeah, it is the fifth and final round, the championship round. Yeah. It's going to work like this. The guy is going to pick three numbers from to one hit to 20. All of them. First one will he be worth two points. Second else has one is miss. three points. Yeah. Third one is Rod five Rod is points. Dan Merle, you have a two-point lead. Please sorry, choose guys. three numbers from. I, I mean one that legitimately. <laughs> I'm sorry. One, I know. I know. Just eight, so upset. And sixteen. <laughs> one eight and sixteen. John Roca, Roca, take it from Merle. Here. Keep the belt Three, on collider, six, please. Three six nine. Mark Riley. Three six nine. Damn well, girl. After a very special date of April 11th. So four and eleven. And seven. Four, eleven, and seven for the champion. All right. Mark Riley, you are going to be going first here in order to That's avoid two a questions TKO in a row. here. Uh, sorry. Mark Riley, you chose category number four for your two-point question. You chose movie release dates. Oh, oh that's gross. All right. <laughs> Mark, Mark Riley. That's it. What year saw the release of the Mel Gibson 2000. and Helen Hunt film? Oh, 2000. Movie? Damn it. Repeat the question, please. <laughs> oh, Scott. That was, that was a good move. Okay, so yeah. what year saw the release of the Mel Gibson and Helen Hunt film What Women Want? Five. 2000. Come on. Four. Three. Two. One. 1997. Uh, 2000. 2000. Mm. So Mark oh, Riley. Oh, Samsonite. I was way off. <laughs> Mark Riley will need to hit this or he will be eliminated mathematically. All right, here we go. Mark Riley, you chose 11 for your second nope. category. And that is the category of action adventure. Nope. Action adventure. Could be it's going to be Steve Buscemi's character went by the nickname Rockhound in what I'm 1998 again. adventure? I thought it was Con yeah. Air. No, Con I thought it was Con Air. No, Con was 97. Four. Three. Two. Repeat the question, please. Uh, uh, that's it. Steve Buscemi's character went by the nickname Rockhound in what 1998 adventure? Come on. Is it Con Air? Oh! Mark Riley has been eliminated. Armageddon. It was Armageddon. Armageddon. Dan Merle and Roca. The title is now going to lie with one of those I think this is where Roca two. wanted to sit. Now we jump Roca, to John bring Roca. it home. Let's Don't let Merle Roca. Come on, Roca. Roca. To tie Dan Merle. I've never chosen on Merle needs to, Merle needs to, needs to miss. That's right, the problem. Roca. Could kill me. The first number you selected was the number three. Let me guess family films. Probably. That gives you the category of Back to the Future. Oh, oh shit. Yes. There's a category for Back oh, to the Future! <laughs> for two points. <laughs> okay. And the tie. What brand of underwear Calvin was Mark Calvin, Calvin Klein. Klein in Back to the Future? Come on. Calvin Klein. Calvin Klein. Sorry. Say that again. I'm sorry, they all grow. Yeah, no, no, that's, that's right. You'll get a free one you on that. You'll get a free one. Here it is. What yeah. brand of underwear was Marty wearing in Back to the Future? Come on. Come on. Shut the fuck Roca. up. Roca. Crowd's reacting. Come on. Come on. Come on. Damn it. Shut the no, fuck hey, up. Hey, you're, you're in the crowd doing it all the time. Quiet. They can cheer. 
Sure. They they can do it. They can react. Yeah. I don't know. One, five. Through to the loom. Oh, oh man. Oh. oh. I think he was. Oh. He got himself out of That's two back, back to the yeah. future questions in a row. Yeah. Wow. Wow. All right. All right. So John Roker that. needs to hit a three in order to send the At the start of the fit, when he first gets woken up by his mum, she goes, "You're under wear it. Your name's Calvin." Um, For your three-point question, you chose the number six, which corresponds with the category of horror thriller. Nah, oh, shit! Oh, God. Who plays Darcy, oh. the owner of the bar and Patrick the Stewart. skinheads in the horror thriller The Green Room? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I never no. saw this. Oh, man. Shit. Give him a minute. Oh. He saw this for a second. Five. Four. I'm sorry, Perry. I was supposed to watch Three, this. Two. I'll on. repeat the question. All right. He's got one more. <laughs> Who plays Darcy, the owner of the bar oh, and the leader of the skinheads in the horror thriller Green Room? Oh. Five, no. Four. Three, no. Two. I don't know. Claire Forlani. Nah. We're uh. looking for Patrick Stewart. Oh. Wow. So it comes down oh. to this. Oh if God. if Roca. I'm if, sorry, I thought a woman. What what was the way you phrased the question? I'm who plays sorry. Darcy? Who plays Darcy? Darcy. Yeah. That's what threw right. me off. I thought that was a, right. it's a woman's name usually. Uh, it comes down to this. Shit. If Roca misses, not Dan good. Merle will be champion via TKO over Riley and Roca with this question. All right, Roca, for your five pointer, you selected the number nine. That gives you the category. Of movie quotes. Oh, 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 oh God! God. The for worst. five points, and to extend this match, what Tim Burton film has the quote, "Hold me, I can't." Is it Ed Wood? Uh, it's nice. gonna, and because of that shot, you're gonna hear it. Your winner. Four. Ah! Edward Scissorhands. For five points, John Roca. Oh! 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 John Roca for five points. Dan Merle, Dan Merle has a good chance here. All he needs to do. He, need, he can hit the two pointer right, so and then. Dan Merle. And that's it. You chose yeah. category one, which is in the category of westerns. Uh oh. Western. Oh! Fuck. Uh -oh. Which, which actor played the murderous outlaw Tom Chaney in the 2010 film? Josh Brolin. Josh Brolin. Oh, Josh Brolin. I've never seen that before. Josh Brolin? Ah! Two points. Nice. Two points. All right, so Dan Merle just needs to hit either his three, three or, or his five, five and he will once again be the champion. Oh, so close. God. Either way, In the he next breaks category, the record. Dan, you chose That's true. comic book movies. Oh. Oh. Well, it's been Best game. <laughs> Your three-point question, Dan Merle. Who plays Bruce Willis's wife Maggie in Surrogates? Oh. Surrogates. Oh. Fuck. That's a good question. That's yeah. a great round. That's a great that's a round good, five question. question. Um, five, four, three, two. Robin Wright. Looking for Rosamund Pike. Ooh. And it comes it's down to the this. Oh my final God. question. The final question. The final question. Wait. Oh, Dan oh, Merle, oh, we're right back to the one pointer. Shades Please. of February here. Dan Merle, <laughs> I, if he hits it, he I don't wins the title. Dan Merle, if he misses it, come on. John Roca is once again the champion. Here we yeah. go. Dan Merle, Roca, your category was Roca, 16. Roca, category Roca, of three. famous actors and uh, actresses. Bosh. Roca, 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 three, being please. remade with Jude Law, which Michael actor Oh, as Alfie yeah. Elkins in 1966. He knows it. Michael Caine. Yeah. And oh. your winner! Oh. And once wow. again, the movie trivia schmuck! Well, look. Champion of the world! Dan He's the best competitor. Like, I'm Dan sorry. He is the best competitor. Oh. Oh.
Look at Roca. Roca's giving respect here. Yeah. Hugging. Yeah. 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 Roca. For, and Riley's handing All over right, the belt. All right, 50 minutes. And then Open look at the up. three yeah. champions. Yeah. 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 A round of applause for the three champions there. Merle takes the belt again. Roca showing respect to Riley. They're all showing in the new Merle order. And there is your champion, Dan Merle. So, guys, we are going to hear Grace Hancock is going to now talk to Something's the reigning happening. champ. Dan Something's Merle. She's going to talk happen. to Mark Riley, and she'll talk to John Roca in just a second. I have to. Hey guys, here I am with former two-time champ Mark Yodi Riley, the one and only. My friend, wasn't your shiniest moment. No, it was It not. seemed to be that the wheel was not your friend today. How are you feeling? Well, he got that... his strength. It was know, just the questions. That, that was a bad just... match for me. Everybody has a bad match. They do. Not when you're in a championship <laughs> match with those guys. And my hats are off to both of them. Dan Merle's a hell of a champ he deserves that belt john roca is a hell of a champ. he earned it he did hell of a guy he did he can't take anything away a lot of things back but that was just one of those matches that's gonna haunt me forever but you said something interesting former two-time champ right i'm very happy about that i've been in this league from day one no i built this league from day one no i'm on the top of the mountain no. i've been with those guys no. i'm happy to say that we are the three no, no, best no. competitors in this league okay. everybody wants to anoint a new champ off of one match i am still nine and four yeah. i'll nine still fight four. for harlow finalis three knockouts but i can i have my face is on a shirt for god's Your sake face is on a shirt for i'll god's take sake. it I'm one of the best to play the game. You are. I'm happy with that. I wish I could take some things back, but my hats are off to those competitors because they are the best in the game. I mean, there's no bad blood between you guys. Absolutely you are not. You usually always like, get it, get it, get it, get it. You're a champ. What's next for you? Uh, what's next for me is uh, oh boy. I'm a veteran in this league. You are. It, I feel it. Wait. I'm taking a step down. You are. For, no. Uh, what? I don't know for how long, but I'm definitely going to stop competing in the movie trivia <sighs> league at this point. Shit. Okay. There's a lot of things and that I need to do. The salt in the there's world. a lot of help that I'm doing here <laughs> with the game itself, the game that uh, I helped build. You there did. are a lot of things that I want to do behind Sorry, the scenes. Sorry, he's not going to be in the tournament. I need a break. It's time. You've earned a break. I think so. I'm happy with my record. I'm happy with what I've done. And here's John Roca. You can't uh, complain with that record, John, though. Okay. Oh, my no. God. Here's a lot of you can't. fellas. I understand all these guys. It's all these guys. Are they recruiting? Listen, I want to tell Are you they that. recruiting? Let's just say. Nah. Played a hell of a match. I got nothing but respect for you. This is John Roca. Like. I said in the past, went back and forth. Said some things that weren't great. I'll tell you, I'm sorry. I got respect for you. Aww. Great champion. It was an honor to play you. It was an honor to beat you. It was an honor to lose to you. I just want to take my hand. Your brother for life, man. I wish you the best of luck. Do whatever you need to do. I'm here well, while you're you taking your break. I will take and I will that's, be, I'm that's there for the you if you need I like when he's like this. Right back at you. You're a great champ. You're a great former champ. You played a better game than me. You played a hell of a game. You took Dan Merle to the last <laughs> question. That's what a hell of a player is. I'm happy to be with you. I'll take it, man. I accept this your apology. This is a really beautiful moment to be watching. Champ. And, uh, can, I, can I say something? Can I say oh, something? What is... If you don't oh. mind? Wait, wait. Um, what? No, Nothing. Go ahead. I want to hear I'm what you out. have to say. Are you okay. seven? Oh, no. I have, no. Uh, one thing I'd like to say. Is this? Oh, oh, this is it. Mark was leaving. Roca, Let's just, I've seen I guess a that lot, everything just goes now. a lot of fight from you in the last couple of matches that you played. You worked your heart out. You played your heart out. And I think your last couple of matches have proved one thing. You should never have been champion in the first place. <gasps> Of your so called oh, they're breaking up, condescending oh, condescending they're all breaking up. Look at you guys, Four horsemen has gone. Me of movie trivia in your last match, and this Grace was just like, a new key. I don't even know what to do with this. In fact, I actually, I'm gonna need to uh, bring in some help here, Ricky. Back to the future questions. This guy makes me 
look like a champion. Listen, You're oh. not a man. I'm tired. What are you no, talking about? No, screw you. If you would spend more time supporting oh, this fuck. guy instead of building this outrageous outfit, maybe more time yeah. watching oh recent God. movies or even classics, no you'd be a lot better than you are. Say, you know what? No, so he deserves right better. He, de he deserves to be the champion. Oh, and he's going to be the God. champion. I tried to make I him champion. This. I tried to make him champion. He went worse. So he was the worst. I'm going to clear this up right now. I'm going to make this up right now. You are nothing before us. No, 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 we don't need him. We don't need we him. We don't need him. We got three strong competitors. He's we got Burnett, the two of us. He's one and two. We got an opening in the stable. Adios, motherfucker. That's right. Adios. That's right. You know what? <laughs> okay, yeah. so now that that's Roka didn't see that one coming. Get oh, out of here. No one saw that. Oh. Save it for the match. Yeah, okay. yeah. Save okay. it for the match okay. and lose right. that one, too. <gasps> boys, boys, my That's God. happening. Okay. It's actually going to happen. Let's talk about the match. I'm going to take out an elephant gun and put him down. Yeah. Harloff is going to happen. Bibiani is going to happen. Okay. Thanks for sticking by. It's coming. You know, you and Riley just had a great moment. That was, yeah. you know, was I, was, I was telling Riley, there's there's no bad blood between the three of you. And No, I'm, I'm, I'm glad there's know, no bad blood you know, here, because oh, yeah, that would be really the, shitty, after, especially after what I just saw. Seriously, Bibs? I, did. End, oh. I mean, also, I think, from this. What are you feeling right I think now? there can be nothing but respect between Riley, Merle, and Roka, because now it's like all three of the champs went at it. What's going on here during the You're game? clearly here at the wrong hours. All right. <laughs> no, Taking your, it right question? back What's your question? To... How are you feeling? Uh, I'm feeling good. A lot better than our loss because I really felt like I let right, Matt down right. in the tag team match. But I fought hard. You did. Listen, I knew Calvin Klein in my head. I just got in oh, my head and started on. thinking underwear versus jeans. And I just got confused. And I, I just didn't say it. And I should have said it. And if I had heard Bald in that question, I probably would have answered Patrick Stewart because I knew he was in there. For some reason, Bald got lost when I was processing stuff. So sometimes the blindfold is really great, and other times I don't quite hear Yeah, something. do you yeah. feel like this is one of those days when the blindfold didn't work out for no, you? No, I think I was in contention because the blindfold kept me in contention. I just okay. think I got a little flustered. Oh, yeah. 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 The blindfold yeah, I mean, it happens, was a good so we've thing seen that to pull a lot. out today. And, and Mr. Nost, like, what's next for the two of you? Okay, so now we have this, we have this. What's, what's, com what's coming next? I don't Tournament. know. Somehow we'll be ranked like 32nd. We're gonna have to <laughs> beat 57 people to get our shot again. But you know what? Hats off to the Patriots. Yeah, yeah. They beat us. Uh, they beat us soundly. Fair and square. Fair and square. I, you know. Oh, so we gotta earn fairly. Our shot what a back. concept. And we will. We will. We will oh, be back at the top. Oh, great. Sucks we didn't get them a couple days ago. Right. But we will regain those titles. They will be ours again. And John will take that singles championship eventually. Yeah. I mean, I you guys You guys are a lot of fun. You're certainly entertaining. I mean, if he wins attitude. the tournament, definitely. I well, it's going to take a while because we got to win three tomorrow. matches to get a shot at the title again, Grace. So That's okay. You don't have much well. time left, but we have hope for you. Yeah, thank you. Hey, Schmodown fans, I'm here with our new champion, Dangerous Dan Merle. You just tied Mark Riley. You've taken back the belt. Holy shit, how are you feeling? Uh, a little bit of disbelief. I mean, really? I, going against these two guys, I think it would be foolhardy to go in expecting to win. So were you kind of, were you nervous? Were you tentatively excited to take this belt back? I was excited back? to play those guys. Yeah. If you're going to play two guys, those are the guys to play. But uh, I never went into that thinking, oh, I'm going to win this. Because I think that would just be foolish. Well, Those okay. Guys are too good. They're That's too good. very precious of you. I like that. I mean, the three of you are really, really sweet. I mean, you, the wheel tended to not work out for the two of them. You really didn't have much of a low point during that game. Were you surprised by that? Were you waiting for things to go awry? I, well, you know, I, I got a lucky break. I think if it had landed on anything but horror thrillers with the wheel and opponent's choice and everything, right. I very well may have stuck and not gotten comfort points. Mm. I could not let Riley potentially steal points away. With sure, it was a smart so move. So I got lucky. With the uh, spinner's choice, they got a couple yeah. of unlucky breaks, but right. uh, you know, I, I still think it was a, it was a great game though. I, I still it was think a it great came game. Down to I don't think anyone has anything to be ashamed of, except for maybe not knowing Calvin Klein. <laughs> well, that for sure you should be ashamed of. Okay, so now <laughs> you will be facing the commissioner, uh, one sure. Christian Harloff. How do you feel about that? Uh, Darth Harloff is Darth a dark Harloff. lord of the Sith. Yes, he is, I, as he, we I saw mean, today. I've, I've seen him dismantle I people. I've seen him. I've been on the other end is of he, a dismantle. Is Sam Levine going to pop out right now? Down to the end, but he defeated I mean, himself to. Andy Signal. 30 so minutes left. There are no weak competitors left in this yeah, game. If you get to the top, then you right. deserve just, to be there. Absolutely. I don't know. And uh, just like every other fight, I think he he literally invented the game. 
<laughs> How do you Sometimes go into that? Sometimes makes his own rules, but it's okay. Yeah, there you go. 39 <laughs> minutes if it's not single. Right. Oh. That's my thing. Um, hold on one second. Whoa, wait. Oh my god. <gasps> it's happening. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, Sam here. Wait a minute. Free for all winner. Yes, sir. When no. I won, I was allowed to challenge the new oh, champion. No. Whenever you want. Yeah, whenever, whenever you I want. Wanted. Yes, that's yes. true. And, uh, it, you know. Well, Dan's in the interview right now. Son well, of Dan's a bitch. You want to do it right now? Oh, my I want to do it right now because oh, you know wow. what? Oh, you know Wisconsin what? Is He's the one who won the free tired, throw. But and the winner do. of the free for all oh, um, can challenge the cha Sam the um is on the stage right now. He's actually point, challenging anywhere he wants right it. now. Huh. Do you accept? Pause. Oh. Oh, oh shit! I'm gonna take that as a yes. It's going Let's go down. find out what's happening. Oh here. my god. He looks mad. Oh, 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 we are here, boys. Dan accepted the match. <laughs> We're getting our last title match here. My God, it's a title match. Well, yeah. here we go. Sam yep. And the new Here's funny. If Levine wins, Harloff wins that Earl. title match. If Dan wins, Dan wins, wins the next title match. I haven't, I haven't even had time well, we to have a celebration we, cake. We have to see. <laughs> And it's, Come on. It, it is but let's just deal with so what's we happening have right now. Three championship title defenses in a row where the title has not been defended. The yeah. last guy to actually defend the title? Dangerous Dan Merle. Oh, yeah. perfect. Dan Merle. It was against, <laughs> yeah. It was against it was <laughs> but here's the thing. Dan is rusty at the moment because he just got done fighting a match. There's yeah, no he way he just he got free -for -all done with that triple that threat match. Came in, he beat the one, the only Tom Dagnino in the final round, and here he stands now. The, the moment we're asking who's more iconic, Daniel Bryan or Steve Levine. All right. <laughs> Wrestling fans would get that reference. Off. All right, so the champion, oh are God. you ready? This yes, is I insane. am ready. Sorry, I've been champion for. I didn't even. I had to perk like up and think it's me. Ten again. minutes. Sorry. The challenger. Yes. <laughs> are you ready? As Jefferson Airplane told us, I believe in miracles. Let, let's get ready <laughs> to Schmoda. This is insane. Oh my Dan God. Dangerous versus the inglorious one, Dang Sam well. Levine. Five rounds. How oh, the know. hell did this happen? All right, I have round no clue. number one works the same. The competitors will get eight questions. They will reveal their questions worth one point apiece. 15 seconds to answer. You can ask the JTE rule of repeating three times during the entire match. There is a challenge. I can't now, believe now, this is happening. Now, okay, right okay, now. okay, 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 okay. I have to ask. Not, you will lose it. If you got if how you guys answers all eight correct what, what, in the it's, first if, round, if Merle loses, one, does the stipulation one. apply to him too now? Sam, last chance. You sure what you don't want to wait till JT? I don't. It, I think so. I, I think well, it I don't will. think I'm going to live that long. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Cal's going to freeze over anytime <laughs> soon, John. <laughs> no, got, I'm going to die later this year. It's fine. I'm cool with it. <laughs> all right, here we go, guys. The match is going to begin. Here is the champion. I can't believe this is Question number going round on. one. Right, here, right, here we go, go baby. Who played the Question role number of v one in V for Vendetta? Oh, this is a case question. <laughs> Stupid <sighs> question. God. I had that feeling that Sam was coming, but he's Hugo coming weaving. in such a way. One Sam, that's down, brilliant. Hugo, Hugo weaving. weaving. One point there. Hugo weaving. Sam. That's as far as I got before my brain went, nah, fuck it. Just give Daniel. Oh. Yeah. Uh, he has not competed the free for all. Drew Barrymore plays Josie Geller. Who gets the nickname Josie Grossi in what movie? Is Never it? been kissed? No, I wouldn't be surprised if he's in the movie. That was my nickname too in junior high. I'm sorry, I'm answering these questions <laughs> before one? you guys write yeah. them down. That's my Five, bad. Four. I have it. I have it. I, I think this is right. One, Sam Levine. No, I think this is right. 50 first days? Oh, never mind. All right, Dan. Right. Right. So kissed. One here. All right, question three. Five. Category of still, I, I, Is that even true? Very more empty bitch? Who directed yeah. the 1997 okay. sci-fi mystery film starring Jodie Foster? Contact. Let's have with McConaughey. Fuck. Oh, shit. Chris, Chris, you get that joke, please. It, it That's it. Was. Yeah, I, was 50 that I don't think it's him, but... Five, four, three, I know this isn't right, but two, fuck it. One, pens down. Dan. Robert Zemeckis. Stanley Kubrick. For Robert Zemeckis. Zemeckis. Yeah, I'm going to go with Dan's yeah. answer, Robert Zemeckis. Did you write it down? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, question number four. <laughs> uh, 
Gotta get drama. All right, guys, in drama. Is this gonna be a knockout? Who plays <laughs> this is the younger brother of I don't know. Edward Norton's character in 1998's American History X. Ooh. Oh the is that if you can hit a couple of if you miss dangerous damage pop. Yeah. No one play catch up with Dan Ron. Five. This is four, a little crazy. Three, two, one, no. Sam. Eddie Furlong. That's Edward correct. Furlong. Hill? Dan. Edward ah, that's correct. correct. All right, Dan Merle hits it again. Sam's <laughs> hanging in there though. Dan hasn't missed. All right, question number five. Who voices Poe the Panda? It scares me how good Dan is at this. Panda. Oh my god. Oh, if you don't know this, I would be so hey! sad. Well, but it's Sam Levine, you have to remember. All right, five, four, three, Yay! two, one. Pens down, please. And Dan Murray. Jack Black. Jack Black. Jack Black. Correct. Jack Black. Black. Learn better. Right. Right. Hey! Good. Damn, good. 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 Damn, good. one, guys. <laughs> 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 it's never going to happen again. Look, if he, if he can keep it with within... Three points, like two points. He's got a chance. Samuel L. Jackson. I'm rooting for Sam Levine. Of the Dolphin Hotel in what supernatural? Oh, you know this? It's not a good movie, but yeah, I know this. <laughs> Is it snakes on a plane? I'm just kidding. How many mother snakes are on this plane? Hey, you you gotta keep yourself. Fourteen away. Hotel. Dan Merle hasn't missed. Alright, no, number seven. Stop. In the category of famous actors and actresses, what actor romances Diane Lane in the 2008 flick Nights in Rodan? Nope. Doesn't the um, Yeah. They he romance uh she romances Sam Levine. Oh my god, what's he um Four, his name three, is Sam Levine. Come on. Two, Get on one, it. But Dan. Gear? That's correct. Richard Gear. Oh, hey! Sam also got right. it. Got it. <laughs> so if Dan Merle yeah. hits this, then he will get a bonus question worth one point. Oh right, my! Eight <laughs> perfect round under the category of comedy. The Hanson brothers oh. rough up countless people, both on and off the ice, uh, in this comedy. I know this. I had a poster of Hanson in my office up till last week. <laughs> <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Sam Levine. Slap shot. That's incorrect. What? Dan. Slap shot? That's Sam Levine. Right. Perfect round. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. 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 So wow. Dan ah. the perfect ah. Nice. Perfect round. That is not good for Sam Levine. As it's if he needs the help. Nope. One point. Dan, here's your bonus question. Peter Yunsen <laughs> won an Oscar for Best Supporting Actor in what 1960 all-time classic? Spartacus. Spartacus. Yeah. Damn Spartacus. You're going to say it. Yeah, this is just you can say it out loud. Oh, yeah. I can say it out loud. Yep. Um, Five, four, three, two. Dr. Zhivago? Looking for Spartacus. Wow. Spartacus. Nice. Okay. You know, that, that's he's okay. human after all, guys. All right. He's got a chance. He missed his, he missed <laughs> Tim, Frank, Tim Franco is still the only one to get the bonus Levine question right. Yep. Yeah, it's true. Uh, my you have Tim. pissed off with AB right. now well, that they know it's wrong. The 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 here. The they missed this. Will spin the <sighs> wheel. If it lands this is so stressful. They do not like. They will spin again unless it lands on a point choice, then they'll have to take it. But on the second spin, they have Damn to. Damn, we need to hit comedies. They I get, are at two points apiece. You can go to multiple choice. Or you can hit Tarantino. One point, you can steal. That's true. And maybe he'll get a question Merle. about himself. You have a three point lead. Would you like to go first <laughs> or second? I'll, I'll go with the lucky streak. I'll go first. Go for it, Dan. Put again. that pressure on. Big spin. Spin his head. Spin his head. Where's it going to go? Where's it going to go? Oh, my Sam God. Could use he might. Nice. He might get spinners. Uh -oh. oh my god! Uh oh. Uh -oh. Nah. He's gonna get a perfect oh. start! Oh! Uh, you know, I just so tempted close. fate with this opponent's choice, and I don't think I want to do it again, so I'll stick go with it. He's gonna stick with it. He's gonna stick with it, okay. Alright, here we go. Smart All right, man. Dan, famous actors and actresses. Smart man. How many times has Michael Keaton been nominated for an Oscar? <sighs> oh god. Well, two times three. for that, of three. course. Once. Five. It's just for Birdman. Yeah. For I think so. Is it A, 1, B, 2, hmm. C, what is that? 3, C, 5? A? One point is correct. correct. Dan Merle with one, one point. point here. 
Nine five. It was just right, Birdman. Question two. Just Scarlett man. Johansson and Jonathan Reese Myers star in which Woody Allen? Match film? point. Match. Yeah. Jonathan and Reese Myers. They've had on this showdown before. Correct for two, two points. points. God. Question number three. She's so good. Who was Jennifer Aniston's co-star in 1998's The Object of My Affection? I don't know. I got right. two more points. Wow. Left. Oh my God! Brad Pitt. He's putting his foot Fuck. on the right okay, now. now. All right, and your final. <laughs> what Lord of the Rings actor? Sam Levine regrets doing this. Oh. Commander. Yeah. Oh, um, Billy Boyd. No, uh, the uh, the Aussie guy, um, David um, Wenham. Is it A. Elijah Wood? B. Sean. I'm Ashton. assuming. Nope. That's That's Billy Boyd. D. Billy Boyd. That multiple choice is so big right now. Billy Boyd. For one more point. Dan oh, Moore. yeah, baby. Five here. The nine point lead. I know. Tremendous good thing is Sam is champion. still within and striking Sam distance. Levine, you are up. Give it a good spin. Yes here. and no. All right, wheel. I think this is a knockout. <laughs> Anyone <laughs> disagree? I hate relationship nah. with the wheel. <laughs> love that wheel. Good spin. And I like good Sam Levine. Good good good. Good. I, yeah, I really like Sam oh. Levine. Oh! Oh! But... Oh! oh. 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 Goddamn right, we're sticking with comedy. Oh, right. <laughs> there we go. Smart. Smart. Your first That's question is a, category he's a comedian. comedian. Like he's a working actor. In the movie, comedian. The Princess Bride. Who plays Wallace Shawn? Vicini. Wallace Shawn. Uh, Vicini. Which you could have seen if you watched uh, that watch along. Um, Wallace Shawn. Good work. That's correct. Right. Two points. Right. Right. Oh my. Your second question: The comedy in the butt. category of comedies. Who plays the villainous character, the big guy, in the film, Paul? Uh, what? Sigourney Weaver. Uh, Is times. it? Is yep. it A, Jason Bateman? Wow, she, really? She had that C, weird D, run where she was the big uh, villain. Tom. Like, she was the head of an organization. She did it in Paul, and she did it in um, Cabin in the Woods. Right, oh, point. shit. I, no! There's a court order. I'm not allowed to see any Seth Rogen movies. <laughs> <laughs> so that's why that happened. <laughs> 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 Your next question. That's not surprising <laughs> knowing that he's been blocked by so many people on Twitter. Characters called in Animal House. Flounder. Who played police captain Ed Hoken in the Naked Gun series? Oh. Ed Hocken, but... um, police captain. What's the character's name? Ed. Ed, Ed Hoke, Hawkins, Hawken. Sorry, Hawken. Uh, George Kennedy. Right. Correct for, for Sam Levine. Right. Nice round for Sam oh. Levine. Yep. Nice round, only a four That's point deficit good here. Something to know. If he loses this, I don't think he makes the tournament. The round. No, because so this, this won't count round. towards his record. Yeah, it will. It, will it counts towards his record. It will it's an official match. They will bet okay. their points. A maximum of three, a minimum of zero points. All right, well, if he so wins this, he's the champ. I don't think the risk is good. Big spin for the betting round. Worth it. Is Dan hoping to luck out again? Maybe hit that spinner's I reckon Levine bets three. Unless he, unless he bets animated. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. No. Oh. Oh. Sam Levine. It's just out. Yeah, yeah, no. He's betting <laughs> one, I bet. So, guys, write <laughs> down your points, please. <laughs> cop, 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 and stop, stop, and look at it. He's, right, yeah, he's betting one. Flop, flop, and ship shop. Yeah. wants to wager. Go big. Go home. Dan's, be uh, Dan's betting one. He's only betting one. Sam's for sure only Wait, betting one. Oh, yeah, don't show me show cops. Sam and Dan's bet two. Right, here we go. Okay, here we go. In category of fantasy sci-fi, the underwater science fiction sphere is based on a novel by which author? Michael Crichton. Boards. Right now, I just write. Fuck you, Will. All right, so <laughs> Sam Levine, you are down by four. How many did you bet? I bet the maximum three points. And you guessed. Mr. Oh, Mike, that's correct. Oh, correct. oh, yeah. How many did oh, the oh, 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 I bet oh. two points. Two points, and you bet. 
Michael Crichton. You got yes. it. All right. So, but Sam was able to cut it down by yes. wow. striking, yes. striking nice. distance. Nice. And you know, from our vantage point, I tell you, this Sam is initially wrote down good. one point. He, he thought better of it, and it's a good thing he did because now he's gotten a little bit closer instead of falling further behind. Really? Well, I okay, now I don't know what's going to happen. Watching the match at just yeah. round. Yeah. So Except I think Burl dominates the speed round, which scares me. Round number four, the oh speed what's weird round. Is so There's a lot of time left. I mean, granted, granted, Sam has no chance in this piece. round, but Ken buzz in before the question's over. It'll be worth there, one point. Who However, knows if you though? In, you have two yeah. There's a if you buzz in, There's a lot to happen more behind the scenes than I think so, they're leading on here. That. Yeah. Hey, Merle, you ready? This is awesome. I'm, yeah. oh, I'm excited. Right, Come on, Lydia, yeah, please. First. Speed round. What is the name of the little girl taken by Ellen Ripley in 1986? Newt. Dan. Newt. Correct for one point. All right. <gasps> oh. Oh. All right, here's the second question the speed round. In the film, Come the on, Come on. Who plays Colin Sullivan? This is the a living question. Dan. Matt Damon. Matt Damon. Correct yes. for oh. one point. Matt oh, Damon. no. No, oh, this is not an agreement on. Team. <laughs> this is Question not My folks are going to be watching this. <laughs> <laughs> I can't help Sorry, it. Sorry, guys. Go on. <laughs> Here we go. Brown out. Sean but, Penn yeah, no. plays a stoner named Spicoli. Fast times, oh. Fast times at Ridgemont High? There is. Correct. All you got to do is push it. No. Yeah. I'm telling you. Oh, my. A little faster. Oh, this all is right. bad. This is all not right, guys, good at all. What is the name of the elite group of cool kids in the Lindsay Lohan? Uh, Sam. Uh, the Plastics. plastics. Correct. Correct. He did it. It's still here. Nice. That was right, a good point. You got one. one. That, got one. Now, right? That's yeah. good. That's a really good last, point. Last yeah, question he's in, here. Last if he question. gets this <laughs> In the Matrix, which? what color is the pill that will allow Neo <gasps> to learn the truth about the Matrix? Red. 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 Oh! Correct for one point. He push it. Oh, and the blue pill. The blue pill. So now we go into the fifth round where it is 21. Levine has hit all of his points. Levine has hit all. Sam Levine has hit all. That's the game. That's game over. No, he can miss. Sorry, no. He can miss the. He has to hit the five. And yes. one right. Right. So the yeah. competitors will get to choose three numbers Bottom line's from over. one to twenty. Yeah, Dick is still the champ. Although three. I'll give now, it up to Levine. Four title it, defenses. Five, That's four. insane. He did a good Murray. comeback. You That's for sure. Oh yeah. Please choose three numbers from one to twenty. I, they've served me well. I'll go with one, eight, and sixteen. And Sam Levine. Uh, let's go with six, four, and twelve. All right, here we go. So Sam Levine will be up first. He's trying to avoid a TKO here. So he chose category six, category six for his first, and that's the category, Sam, of Marvel films. Perfect. <laughs> At least it's for the lowest points. Marvel films, two points. <laughs> Who played Kingpin and he Ben so Affleck? Dear Michael Duncan. Clark Duncan. Michael Clark Duncan, yeah. Michael Clark. Very easy question for somebody who'd seen that film. Uh, I would... Ben Affleck, <laughs> Kingpin. Five. He doesn't Lawrence know it. Looking for no. Guys, I've not seen the movie. Michael not once at Clark, all ever. Duncan. Michael Clark Duncan. Michael all right. Clark Duncan. Is he oh, going to get TKO'd? Right, so Sam, Close. <laughs> yep. Sam Levine needs oh, to He has to hit this. He has to hit They're this. They're both tall. Yeah. Sam, Jesus. You guys are... all right. Sam Levine needs to hit. This question, in order to stay in it, otherwise the champion will win via TKO. Oh my. <laughs> in the category of romantic comedy, the following quote is from which romantic comedy? I'll Maybe have ladies. what she's having. When Harry met Sally. For three points. There we go. Yes. Three All right. Alive. Hey. Alive. Sam Levine needs to hit this five pointer in order to force Still Dan Merle to Sorry. have to answer a single question. Correct. All right. <laughs> So we oh have my category 12. This is Sam crazy. Category 12, Sam, you chose the category of 90s movies for your five pointer. Okay. Here you go. You might five hit this. Pointer. It's in what Steve knows. Martin comedy does a magical freeway sign pose the riddle? You will know what to do when you unscramble how daddy is doing. It's one of my all-time It's comedy. LA Storm. For five points. Oh, oh my oh. god. 
You know what? I'm sorry. Yeah, I, I just I want to bathe in this minute for just a second longer. <laughs> so Merle <laughs> only time I'll only ever have needs a point to hit his rear is five. I just want to soak in it. <laughs> Dan Merle is right back to where oh. he was right before <laughs> yeah. about yeah. half an hour ago. Dan Merle it has a chance here. To literally a half game. hour ago. Just yeah, literally. Catch. All right, Dan. Yes, sir. Your first question. You chose the number one. Yes. That gives you the category of Oscar movies. Mm, okay. For two points oh and the tie. But he can what miss this one. What 1970 sports film won Best Director Rocky. for John D. Rocky. Avildsen? Yeah, you misspoke in the question. <laughs> <laughs> the challenge is John G. Avildsen. All right, so Dan Merle now only has to hit his three or his five, <laughs> Wait, and he retains he the title. Or if he misses he's both, not, he will be in a sudden death yeah. situation. All right, Dan. Imagine if this goes for your to second. Oh my God! Question. Blow this one. Get the last one right. It'll be more fun. For three <laughs> points and the win, <laughs> you pick the number eight, and that gives you the category so good. of horror thriller. Oh, he might miss this. Let's go! Name Come on, Levine. Let's see. Who it's Dan. True crime writer Ellison Oswalt in the movie Sinister. Oh, okay. He doesn't know this. That's good. That's Ethan good. Hawk. And your oh, winner! Oh shit! And your still winner! Movie wow. trivia showdown! Champion wow. of the world! Dangerous! That... <laughs> hey, to be fair. He got to the second last question. Wow. So Levine did a lot better than we thought he would. Oh if yeah, he beats me, for sure. He will tie his own record of defeating. I mean, I get to play this guy, and man, uh, what an honor that's going to be. But see, wow. Levine, but nice I can't believe that just happened. No, he really did. He got that into the final questions there, and Dan, and for the first time, he finally he broke the points the record. Has been defended. Yeah. First time this so, year. So, yep. And probably yeah. not the last. All right, what so was it before? 23. 20. Oh my god. Once again, has both. Dan Merle and wow. Sammy. Hey guys, That's I'm right. here again with Dangerous Dan Merle. You just won the title back, and now you just defended Something the title note, back. Levine's now three and four. I don't think he's like... making it to the uh, tournament. Tired. My you brain is buzzing. My brain hurts. Um, <laughs> no, it was a lot of fun though. Yeah, yeah. Did you feel like you having just won it back? Did that kind of propel you into defending it right after that? You know, actually, what propelled me into defending it more than anything, and I don't mean like recently, more than any other loss that I've taken on this show. The free for all has haunted me the most. Really? Because because I just I, yeah. I, I hung in there for yeah. so long. Yeah. Harloff yeah. talked I, about I, that. I knew he that was answer shaking and I just up after come that. Up with it. Yeah. And the fact that I went out on four correct answers and then Draco cleared the board and we were having such a great game. I wanted to see right. that table through to the end. Yeah. Uh, that has haunted me more than any other loss that I've ever had on the showdown. So in well, a way to to beat. Levine, yeah. that doesn't mean I won the free for all, but it kind of helps take the sting out of that <laughs> loss. It takes the sting out of that exactly. haunting memory. Yes. Well, you know, I, I'm i not <laughs> the biggest fan of the way that you left the Lions. Oh my game, God. You know what? The special I, program. You played two really, really strong games. Yeah, really the Lions are going to be in and probation. And probation. Very Thank you very much. Or am I going to be uh, in the uh, closet? Something oh, I need to say before anything else. Uh, yeah. And it's not directed at you. Okay. It's a game. I know what these skunks did. They. I have a video. I know for a fact that Tom Dagnino locked the Emma Fife in John Campion's office. So I talked to Emma Fife. You are going to be suspended for doing this, and so <gasps> will Tom Dagnino, yep. and I'm going to further that out. So oh. I would ask you, please, to take oh. wow. What? Goodbye. What does this mean Goodbye. for the no Stagnino match? Not, not, not well, I'm this is a special program you know, on Tuesday. The first thing I'm going to do before anything is yes, shake sir. your hand. Oh. You yeah, and I, what does that for, mean? For being Knowles, we got to be Knowles. Yeah. This, yeah. this is to, this is a special program you coming are, up. By far, and I told you this many times, you're one of the best people I know in this space. It is an honor to have you. It was an honor to have you the first time as the champion. It is an honor to have you once again as the champion. And now it's going to be an honor to face you for that championship. Well, I, I, it's, it's a privilege to have the championship, and it'll be a privilege to fight you, my friend, because you, you know your stuff. Well, here's the, here's <laughs> the problem I face uh -huh. because I, I just watched seeing you what you did. Um, I face the problem that I'm coming off of a team victory over you, yes. and I know how you get. <laughs> yeah. 
what you just said about the free for all, I'm sure you feel the same way about me. <laughs> I have to be honest, the second biggest sting that I've ever had in that ring was was getting it down to 50-50 on the first Martin Scorsese movie and picking the wrong one. I so I do have a chance now to write that wrong. You do, and and you also and the flip side of that, you defeated my partner in the spectacular. I did. Um, no matter what, if I was to take that off of you, the fans are going to say that I did it in my favor. But I will tell you what, we're going to fight. We're going to have a great time. I'm honored. Absolutely. That's going to be I an to play, interesting match. Oh. I see this oh, nonsense yeah. about Christian floating around. And I'll tell you, I am a true champion. I would not play a man who would rig a game, and I would not play in a rigged game. I walk, and I'm not doing that. I look forward to playing this guy. And whoever wins this game is going to be your champion fair and square. So all that nonsense you're spouting online. Yeah. Stop it. Yep. It's going to be a fair fight. Yeah. It's going to be one yep. hell of a good fight, too. Yep. Well, it's that. definitely, it's going to be. Christian wins. <laughs> Guys, thank you very That'd much for everything, too. <laughs> <laughs> Christian would be so annoyed if he won the belt. <laughs> oh, he would. Night. He would be so one of the best annoyed. Of all time, if not the best. That's the problem. Thank you, sir. <laughs> all right, buddy. Let's talk. First of all, yeah. um, you are one of my favorite people, I'm and you know that. And one of the things that you did, I love the way you entered here, and I love that you went in like you went in like a like a cobra on a, yeah, on, yeah. on a wounded mouse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, how did it work out? Well, the, it turned out the mouse was not wounded <laughs> at all. No, and it, and it really <laughs> fact, the, in fact, that mouse had only gotten stronger. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, no. See, here's the thing. <laughs> True. Oh, because, you know, I was God, in the wings, Yes. To figure out what I love happened, that movie so much. And then I foolishly thought, ah, oh, you know what, I'll do it. I'll I think Sam should, should have no waited and challenged Dan at another time. In no, my opinion, no. If you were no, gonna be, and yeah, it was gonna be after committed. that match. Dan is truly the fiercest competitor in this league. He's really I guess. That, that is a guy but who, I mean, you Levine shouldn't have been the one who won the free for all. That's all. He's had that like, he should have been the one who won the free no, for all. If, if, if someone, if like a Bibiani or someone with a higher. Yeah, or McWeeny or good. someone. No, yeah, no, if someone like no that question. won it. And so this is a much yeah. easier, a bitter pill for me If McWeeny, let's say, say, won it and challenged Dan right now, John I think McWeeny would be the champion. That's nothing against there. Morrow. Right. It's right. just, it's a triple yeah. threat, you know, and then he, you know, knocks me out with a TKO or something. That but you didn't been... get TKO. That was I the thing. I did not. Though. You did not. You fought really yeah, no, hard. Yeah, no, he didn't. The speed round, I think, that, that the hurt you. speed round killed me. I don't know. I uh, Bibiani gave me some tips about that stupid buzzer, and uh, clearly I'll have to know them for next time. Right. But well, listen, uh, that guy's sabotaging everybody. I guess so. And then also, I'm going to have to yeah, show apparently. that video to a... Um, <laughs> A neurologist friend of mine and ask what happened when yeah, I was what happened writing with Hugo, Hugo Weaving thing. I literally don't know. I started writing <laughs> Hugo. Ever on set? Hugo. No, no, no. no. Right. I started writing Hugo and then my brain just went, nah, I'm taking off. You're going to be okay. <laughs> right. like, no, I need, I need you. Finish writing. <laughs> <laughs> finish off without you. Right. And it just stopped. <laughs> exactly who I was trying to write. Right. My brain just went, nah, I'm good. All right, so you've got a shot at the belt here. Oh, that's great. Can we talk about how much Christian looks like a commissioner right here, though? The team thing is oh, yeah. looming over you. You wanted to play in the team league again. I did. I would still like to. So team league, singles league, um, <gasps> the inner geekdom is probably nowhere. Is he going to announce? Right. right. Lord, no. So I got two things. First, <laughs> yeah. let me ask you about the singles. <laughs> is this something now you want to keep competing in singles? Ultimate Shmoney? Either McQueen or McCuga. Oh, you absolutely. That's something you still want to do. Absolutely. I, I, I've said this from the get. I love a good I think uh, Makuga and Levine would be a good trivia. team. The belts and stuff are fun, right. and I know I've always wanted to have Makuga and McQueen. A lot of those guys have all real like factions and stuff, and they take it very seriously. I love movie <laughs> trivia. I'm always happy to play. Well, speaking of teams, I have an option. I'm gonna I'm gonna put you on the spot here too. Yeah. <gasps> I have someone that I think oh. you would actually work with Wait. really well. All right. And Emma Fife asked this person about a teammate, Wait. and the person said, "Well, you know what? I'm not <gasps> really that good with." Well, but she I'm asked both works. of them. I'm, I'm usually there to just show up, do the trivia, be there, and that's Drew McQueen. Drew McQueen oh my. He was. He was part of <laughs> Ain't It Cool for yes. a Godfather at 3-1. Yeah. People were touting Let's him as see the what next best thing. The guy that was going to beat Roka, the guy that was going to beat Merle. They're talking about this guy as the best thing. You're pretty good on that, Mike. You got a lot of flair. I think you and Drew McQueen would be a tremendous team. You know what? Let's do it, Drew. What? Look at this. Drew McQueen. Oh. That's, a, that's out there for you. Sam oh. is here. We're going to put the challenge out to Drew. Thank you so very oh, much, thank Sam. You. You're the man. And Follow Sam. Holy shit. Congratulations that is a scary to Dan team. Merle. It is an honor to lose to That's a man a of his caliber. Team. And you know what, guys? Rocky didn't beat Apollo on the first try either. All right. That's back true. To me. 
Yeah. Well, well, exactly. not so I had to make my way uh, in there back to me. talk to Dan a little bit. Very respectful. There's there's nothing but uh, but love for one of the best champions we've ever had, and he is the king of the division once again. What an event we had here, guys. It was impressive, gentlemen. Yeah, even, that was Even awesome. though I lost, like I said, I'm just in awe of all five of the <laughs> matches that we saw today, down to the wire as oh. it should be with these competitors. I mean, this was like this this felt like crazy. a pay-per-view championship event. I was very happy the way it all panned out. I mean, it did. All the matches guys, yeah. Yeah. make sure that you are yeah. liking uh, and commenting match, on the original man, videos. It was Go really back them. Just comment away, the please. Best of the best, and I'm yeah, really even if it's just like one word, like awesome. And just comment and like. At least like twenty dollars a ticket to be here today. I, they got their <laughs> money's worth. We had drama. We had uh, Bibiani now. <laughs> the likes of Ricky Haber, who apparently has been uh, talking to Bibiani this entire time. And there's a lot, a lot of drama that's been going on, too. That's Broca insane that it ended up being Bibiani. Doesn't seem to be like that outlaw mm. that we saw before. I didn't see that coming. Did um, anyone? Jerry Johns just barely no. misses the Inner Geekdom Championship. The Nerds Watch just, just loses to Rotten Tomatoes, and I will continue to get destroyed by the internet. So um, we... <laughs> It was, it was no. a lot of fun you know. um, <laughs> all the way around. There were no wipeouts the today, though, were there? Predictions. No. And thank you for no. It was good. Dan Merle and John Roca. Mark well. Everybody who participated today, and thank you for... The triple you threat, maybe. Want more events like this? Nah. Keep on comment. Because it came down to the last question. Share. Do the whole thing. Continue into the fantasy league things that you guys are doing. For join two of them. Facebook group, movie trivia, Schmodown. Do it all. Make sure you join Reddit. Keep the word going. That's how you get more events. Oh, There's a Reddit page? Thank you, guys. Yeah. So oh, I don't do Reddit. Much. Ken Napsuck. Yeah, I'm scared do of that. Ken Napsuck. John Campia. I mean, I've never been on Reddit, but... See you next time. We gotta hear about something going on on Tuesday. Some things to say. Oh! <gasps> Oh, it's going to be 10 minutes in the cruise. You're going to be here with your collider collision like you, fantasy yeah. update. This is going to be a long one. <laughs> Where's I'm gonna Cody? Need some... I, thank you. There he is. Oh, you, uh, I, I, thank I, you. I'm holding a microphone. <laughs> okay. We got some sweat coming in. What's my first match? All right, you got Rotten Tomatoes versus Nerds Watch. Rotten Tomatoes versus Nerds Watch. Now, who won that? Rotten Tomatoes. <laughs> tomatoes versus nerds watch. Now you thought coming in Rachel the Crusher Cushing was gonna own this and carry Ken Napsuck on his back. Ken Napsuck actually showed up and I love him like a brother, but sometimes his trivia knowledge is hit or miss. <laughs> Thank you very much, Cody. I appreciate that. Now, <laughs> tomatoes again. Great Drake usually Matt actually carries her the whole great. way. This has been a game of flip flop, flip flop. Rotten Tomatoes, however, and Nerds Watch are teams that you should keep on your fantasy team. You should be proud of them. You should hold on to them. If you think you could actually get some singles, if you're lacking on singles, use them for trade bait. They are money makers, but they're also a lot of competitors. They compete a lot, yeah. they score a lot, and they're very yeah. good looking. Who's next? You got a Hector Navarro <laughs> versus Jeremy Johns. Hector Navarro versus Jeremy there are Johns. There's so in many the inner Kingdom cool guys to do championship. Right now. Two nerds going face to face. So many paper towels. I'm sweating. This is only the second match of the <laughs> fantasy update. Hector Navarro, very handsome. Jeremy Johns got a lot of hair. Either way, the Toots dudes know what they're talking about. They Toots scored a dudes. lot of points. Thank you, Cody. Uh, <laughs> that is true. I am dying over here. <laughs> what you want to see in an inner geek to match is a pound for pound, belt for belt, body blow by body blow match, and they pulled this it off. I am very impressed by both these yeah, guys. This is awesome. You don't need a separate fantasy league, but however, if you want to start a new fantasy league within the inner geekdom, it's a hell of a way to make your league deeper, darker, and a little more mysterious. I think both competitors are fantastic. They both dress well. <laughs> Hector Navarro is great at tweeting, although Hector is funny. From, it's a very uh, cocky John Twitter handle. What there. were you thinking when you signed <laughs> up for Twitter? What's my next match? You got uh, Christian versus Jeff Snyder. <laughs> Christian Harloff versus Jeff Snyder. Two guys who look and sound Probably, I think, like I think they that's know the best movies the and they prove it right every time. Now, Christian Harloff, mm. you didn't know if you should keep him in fantasy, but you probably nah, dropped him in passing repeated threat. a lot. Now he's coming in hot. He beats Jeff Snyder. Thanks for that <laughs> towel. That really didn't do much, but dust <laughs> off the top of my head. Christian Harloff, <laughs> he seems to come in when he don't think he's going to win. <laughs> Jeff Snyder was on a hot streak. Bibiani, he beat me. And then Harloff comes in with the communist <laughs> hammer of a man from Queens, New York, a man from uh, Florida State, running things and beats him into submission. The entire rap staff <laughs> is crying in their sleep as they watch their boss lonely walk home with no fantasy huh. points. Well, you got a few because they got to split it in half. But you know what I mean. Christian Harloff is <laughs> so hot right now. He's like Hansel in the first Zoolander. Don't even talk to me about Zoolander 2. What's next? The three-way championship match. The three-way championship match, the moment you have all been waiting for. Mark, yo, do you have... Thanks, Cody. I need some cards. I need some cards. <laughs> Mark Yodi Riley holding on to his belt against John Roca and Dan Merle. Now, Dan Merle, he was champion for a long time. He seemed unbeatable. Then all of a sudden, he gets beat. Buster Douglas knocking out Mike Tyson style. 
He's back. This was a game of not how many you could get right, but how many you actually couldn't he's miss. He's so worn out. This was a battle. Mark Riley misses he's two. True. He's out of it. That's true. He's gone. The bout's gone. John Roca takes him in. What? It doesn't happen. Now, Dan Merle, <laughs> he is the competitor of all competitors. He scares me walking down the street. He should scare hey, every fantasy Kurt, team out there. Serious. You know why? You have Riley on because your team. Because he wins, and he scores a yeah. lot of points. You might Mark, have to... Dan uh, Merle I don't know what I'm going to do. Peyton I have Manning to think about of 2003, it. 2003 of Movie Trivia Smowdown Fantasy. And I have I'll to tell talk you to my league. Because you can depend on him. He will not throw interceptions. He will score, and he will win. And I think he's a very, very nice person. Finally, what's my next? You got uh, Dan Merle versus Sam Levine. Sam Levine steps out. You think he might have a chance? Nope. Dan oh, we are Merle getting something again. from the four horsemen. Strong with the belt. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, four minutes left. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> All right, finally, Dan Merle. <laughs> Dan Merle holds it against Sam Levine. If you had Dan Merle in your fantasy, Pass off to Josh just Kuga sit and back Cody on your bed of fantasy points Ooh. and watch yourself win match after match. Go to your local bar and say, I had Dan Merle, and tell Whoever all the other Dan people Merle in your fantasy league, league that they can go now, straight to hell. Tonight. I'm Josh McCuga, exhausted, may have choked on some water, and full of, cat, full of goldfish. We'll see you next time on the Movie Trivia Showdown. Get those fantasy leagues going. Oh my god. We still got four minutes. Yeah. Oh, I think this is just uh, like what they did this Okay, yeah, yeah, yep, yep. This like, is just little... credits, so. Oh, no. Okay, no, let, let's, let's keep watching it because this is pretty cool. Yeah, no, of course we're going to keep watching it, but we're, we're going to take this time to now reflect on the match, oh, the, the, this man. event. Holy shit. I mean, look, these things are a fucking marathon. And yeah, I'm worn out. This is amazing. And okay, guys, I'm um, I'm gonna give you a little behind the scenes right now. We're still recording a worldwide trivia match tonight. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Good luck with that. <laughs> yeah. Me and Chris that. are gonna have some fun tonight. <laughs> we are gonna have some fun tonight. And Kearns, if you're available to join us in for the fun, then feel free to, man. But uh, I I don't know. Man. Right. Fair enough. Um, but. This has been single-handedly one of the craziest turn of events for an entire week of this content. And I gotta say, once again, once again, as always, Collider. Yeah. Oh, this is why we love the showdown. Is this week the matches we saw and the it's. It doesn't even matter who won, it's just the matchup we saw. This is why I'm a fan of this show. This is why we schmo down. Exactly. And Actually, the one big question I have coming out of this is Jeremy Johns, where does he go in your kingdom? That's, I think that's my one big question, actually. That and the Lions Den. Um, he'll probably fight the winner of um, Burnett, or he'll probably fight the winner of Cushing and Kalinowski. No, he's gonna. No, I think the winner of that plays Coy, the winner of. Boy versus whoever plays um, Hector. Yeah. That's what I think. True. Never mind then. Okay, I'm full of shit. <laughs> he probably will. He probably will be someone who someone who wins a five way will play. That's yeah. What I think. Probably. So, all right, you've been all about this special program on Tuesday, Jacob. What do you reckon it's gonna be? It's to do yeah. with Emma. It's to do with Emma. It's all to do with Emma, and then next week will be, and and at the end of it will be Finstock's allowed, oh sorry, Tom Dagnito is allowed to play Matt Nost, and then the Matt, and that's how they're going to do it. And so, maybe there will be a stipulation to the Matt Nost match, like if Tom loses, he he's banned. He's out. Something. He's out. Yeah. Or something like that. Something. Man, we are, just, we are just really trying to get Tom out of this space, even though... Hey, hey, I, don't, I want him in. What's this wee stuff? Well, I'm talking about okay. <laughs> Kearns, Kearns, you to you him. know that I am a fan of Tom Dagnino. You know that yes. I'm a fan of Finstock. But my yeah. God, sometimes people just need to learn to shut their freaking mouths. Oh yeah, I agree. Okay, I, here we go. We have I one minute left. We got one minute left. Here All we go. All right, here we go. Following footage was what found minutes it? after the end of the collision. Ricky, Ricky, when are we doing this? We've been setting this up for months. I am sick and tired. I have to be on that showdown and take that crap. From the It's gonna be tonight. Tonight is your time. You've been leading him on for months now, and that's good. You give him a little bit, and then you come back, and then you give him some shit, 
and then you're nice. It's all part of the plan. He doesn't see this Tuesday. Don't you understand? Yeah, this is Tuesday. Tonight, we bring the whole thing down. You're better than them. And you're gonna be the best. Now that you got me in your corner. Last we'll give ourselves to the horsemen. But last we'll have our This is what I like to hear! Oh! Huh? And oh, wow. Uh, what did he say about the horseman? To our YouTube channel. It'll It'll help help at last, we will reveal ourselves to the horseman. At last, we will have oh. revenge. He quoted Phantom Menace, and it sounded beautiful. Okay, so. All right. I'm, 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 I'm just about done. So I'm confused. Yeah. What is Tuesday? Is this Lion's Den, or is this? I think, oh. li I think it's. There it are there are a million risky. possibilities as to what it there, is. Exactly, yeah. there are a million possibilities on what this could be. But bottom line, we'll find out on Tuesday when yeah. you'll see uh, the the main Tuesday crew <laughs> most likely. So, um, Lauren, I gotta ask you, what was for your first big Schmodown event? How was it? <laughs> it was a little bit long. <laughs> Fair enough. No, yeah, it's actually really good. I really enjoyed it. Actually, I didn't know anything, but. I think just watching and enjoying it <laughs> the whole point. So thanks for having me. Nice. Yeah, no, uh, of course. Yeah. You know, and when 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 Jacob uh, pitched this to us, we're like, shit, yeah, because not only are we liking this, but who else likes this? Christian. Why? <laughs> it's more. It's more people to get invested in this. More people to help spread the word exactly. about this great idea. So, once again, thank you for. Uh, uh, spending four hours with a bunch of dorks on the internet. <laughs> oh my god, this was four hours. Yeah. <laughs> like, but it's four hours. It. It's four hours. I don't want back. Oh man. <laughs> I, I can assure you, I'm going to be watching that Snyder Harloff match a few more times. That oh, just everything I, on the line. So I, I finished tonight with four out of five. I got all but one right. I'm thinking about. Oh, 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 sorry. All but one wrong. Because I picked... Oh, no, I got two wrong. Sorry. I got two right. I only yeah. missed Riley. So I'm three, and then I'm three and two. Haha. -ha. Yeah, I'm three and two. Me, me Just and like my record tight. will be after I face Sasley. Wait, wait, wait. Habuya. Did I... Did I win? I think yeah, you, you did. did. I think you Either did. you were Abe. Either you were Abe. <gasps> Although, okay, to be fair... I was going for Roka. I did pick Mo at the start. Oh, that's I, right. I, okay, as I was saying, and if you watch our summit, but you, you chose Nerd Watch. You did shoot. Yeah. You did pick Merle officially. So I did pick Mo, but my I was. I it was. This is the one I want to get wrong, but I'm picking Mo. Yeah. So anyway. Okay. I mean, so all that being said, guys, thank you for watching. Hats Legal. off to Christian. Hats off to Christian. Yeah. Hats, Hats off, off to Campia. To Hats off to Collider for topping themselves. Hats off to Adam, Thad, Coster, Cody. Hats off to all of them. Oh, God. All of them. All of them. All so, right. once again, guys, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to Take Three Productions. We would appreciate it. But, of course, give the love and support to Collider. Like those videos, comment on those yeah. videos, subscribe to Collider. <laughs> For Take Three Productions, for Jacob London, Lauren Foister, Evan DeGraff, and Matthew Kearns, I'm Chris Dolman. We'll see you guys next time. Take care.